We're excited that we get to spend a little bit of time with our good friend, Mr. Andrew Lesman. Yeah, I'm carrying beverages Please, here. Please, Andrew's <laughs> brought with him yeah. a lifetime supply Muriel, of drinks. Muriel jokes that if, if she could never last a two-hour show with as much <laughs> tea as I drink during the shows. Yes. But you love your tea. Yes. It keeps you hydrated. It keeps me hydrated. And, and so, focused. And, and focused, yes. But actually, a little bit of green tea, which normally I don't have later in the day, but mostly it's, as, as we were talking about before the show, let it or unleaded. it. Although my green tea has very little <laughs> caffeine in it. I could, I could drink the green tea in the evening, which I couldn't drink coffee in an evening when, and go to sleep. It would be, I'm one of those people who marvel at someone who could have a coffee or espresso yep. at dinner. I'd, I'd be up till morning. But do you ever have coffee now, or do you normally stick to the tea? Coffee for me is, is a, and especially there's great research on coffee in terms, coffee is an extract to the coffee bean. So as long as you don't add bad things to it, mm -hmm. the research on coffee is overall very, very positive coffee. Although in the state of California, with their crazy Prop 65 thing, um, coffee, because of its acrylamide content, is supposedly going to be labeled a carcinogen with warning signs about cancer, which is, Ridiculous uh, that Prop 65 in California has morphed into something other than it was originally intended to be, but we digress here. <laughs> so I've, and I have a list of all sorts of questions here as well. Current affairs, hot topics, everything we're going to no, be well, talking about tonight. And Andrew, as you said, we're locked and loaded with so many questions. Yeah, I, and the reason why, that's why I wanted to start with Essential One, because mm. one of the most common questions I'm asked is, where do I start? Right. What's what's the first of your product products that that I would start with that gives a good sense of your product line, that gives a good sense of what makes your products different, that is from a nutritional standpoint the best place to start, and a multivitamin, multimineral. They're the essential nutrients that define a healthy diet. That's where you start, and it's a single capsule. Like all our products, it's 100% pure, additive free. No other products have that, that can even say that. Uh, it contains our unique forms of B12, vitamin D. It it's, it's like a separate formula. So for most people, at 2,000 IU vitamin D, it's, it's the perfect start to vitamin D. It's multiples of what you'll get in a standard formula, but it's actually where you need to start in terms of health and getting healthy vitamin D levels. But, and also what's, and we'll talk about this a few times. I'm often asked, when should I take mine? Uh, what is the best time of day to take Essential One? When's the best time of day to take CoQ10? When yeah. is the best time of day to take Omega-3s? And the answer is, the time of day that works best for you, because you want to take most of these products with food. Most companies say that because their products would be too upsetting to your stomach otherwise. Mm. Our products are designed to be neutral to your stomach, so that's not the reason. The reason why is back to what I said. What, what defines a healthy diet? Vitamins and minerals. When are those vitamins and minerals best absorbed? when they're part of that healthy diet. So what you want to do is introduce your essential ones, vitamins and minerals, with a healthy meal. So it's coming with the macronutrients that stimulate and create the best environment for the absorption of those vitamins and minerals. So whether it's my vitamin or anyone else's, you wanna take that multivitamin, you wanna take those omega-3s, you wanna take them with food. You wanna take your CoQ10 with food. That's when it's going to be best absorbed. So it's not with ours a question of making them more mild, because ours are already mild. It's just a question of getting the maximum value, as they say, the bang for your buck. You wanna get the nutrients delivered, you wanna get them absorbed, and that means it's best to take them with food. So whether it's breakfast or lunch or dinner, you could take essential one with dinner, no problem. You could take it if you wanted with an evening snack, no problem. I generally take my vitamins, I split them between breakfast and lunch, mm. and that works best for me. If I forget or if something's going on, I'll do dinner. Mm. So it's something that, the one product I was joking before with Adam, that there's one time of day to take. I don't think we're taking it, talking about it during the show. It's our nighttime product. Right. You take that before you go to sleep. <laughs> so obviously, <laughs> you don't want to take that during the day. Um, things like Cholesticare or Choco Nuvo, Ultimate Oatmeal, we'll talk about those later, that are involved in cholesterol reduction. Mm. You take them with food because they block cholesterol absorption and the reabsorption of bile. So e each one, it's common sense. But again, with my products, you take them at the time that works best for you. When is the best time to eat a healthy meal? At the time that's best for you. And these are dietary supplements, they're not drugs or medicines. So you take them with a meal at the best time that works for you. 
We're gonna go through many different topics tonight and wonderful products, some of which I've never had the chance to present with Andrew. I do wanna to say to anybody that wants a start, a beginning, an introduction to Andrew's line, uh, Essential One is a way to go. I think a lot of us at home can relate to a multivitamin. I will tell you, I was horrified when Andrew revealed to me the comparisons between Centrum One A Day and the other big brands. It's scary. Yeah. No, it's... As I have often said, when people ask me about taking those, I, I say they're they're better the, they're better than taking nothing. But when you look at the levels that you get, when you look at the artificial colors that are still in those products, you could watch a you could watch a video of me um, on QVC in 1991, where I'm going through the list of artificial colors in those vitamins, right. and I say eventually they won't have them anymore. They're obviously going to go away because artificial colors, with our changing perspective about health, artificial colors have no place in a multivitamin. Here we are, almost 40 years later. What is that? 30 years later? 30 years later? 40 years later? <laughs> Don't hate um, yourself too much. It, but, and they still contain artificial colors. Wow. So uh, our essential one is truly unique from its purity, from the form of nutrients it contains. It, it's, it's designed to deliver the vitamins and minerals you want at the levels you require, to do it affordably, economically, so it's value for value much less expensive than even those $10, $12 bottles of the leading brand. When you look at what you're getting in a year's supply here, a separate B12, a separate vitamin, vitamin D, and that also begs another question that I'll get into, which we have redesigned our products in terms of the B vitamins and B12, because a lot of products, if it's the only one you're taking, you still need the B vitamins in there. So what we've done in our CoQ with our multivitamins, we've lowered the respective levels of B complex and B12 because we've validated their efficacy at lower levels. And in so doing, even if, like me, you take our Essential One and you take CoQ10 and you take other products that might contain B vitamins, you're not getting levels that are too high. With vitamin D, you could choose, say that our Essential One is 2000 IU we're talking about here today. If you wanted to have 4000 IU vitamin D daily, as I do, then you just make sure that your separate vitamin D or your CoQ with vitamin D is at 2000 IU. Simple math to do. So it's very easy to look at the key nutrients. We design our product to never deliver too much of the nutrients you're seeking. It's a wonderful, wonderful way to begin that regimen. We had a lot of questions about where to start, and this certainly is going to be great for you. Um, one of the things that we won't talk a lot about tonight is pricing. Everything we're going to do is still special pricing. And Andrew, this is kind of the, the end of your big two-week visit, isn't it, tonight? Well, what we do is we tend to do six hours on one Sunday and then six hours on the following Sunday. We used to do... 25 hours in a visit and Did we used to do really? that we used to do that every month i think that was if before you, my time if you went back over 20 years that was it we were doing 250 300 hours a year wow. now we're on about 60 hours a year so we do our six hours and our six hours and, and this week you were kind enough to share the monday night shows with us so this is our opportunity to sort of answer questions and, and really go uh, into sort of the general information about using my product yeah. so everyone benefits from them and understands, my goal is everyone understands what they're doing, so it's not just blindly benefiting from a product, but actually using them in the best fashion possible. I find, and I, when you first introduced me to the calcium magnesium product that you offer, I found it fascinating when you were talking about calcium, not so easy to absorb in the body, and a lot of us are taking those rock hard tablets still. Not so easy to absorb, and in, in my mind, we don't need to be taking the extremely high levels that have been recommended in the past. Right. Again, Again, sounds contrary to someone who makes vitamins to tell you that you should be using or taking less, which is one of the reasons why uh, we make sure that if you're getting calcium, we want it to be a sort of an independent, affirmative decision. Of course, our calcium magnesium intensive care will not upset your stomach. It's easy to swallow. It's not swallowing a rock. It's right. swallowing a, a capsule with an ultra fine powder that delivers the calcium you need, but it's designed to be efficient. It's designed to not require the levels of 1,000 or 1,500 or 2,000 milligrams of calcium or magnesium. What I always say when it comes to calcium magnesium, the key is really getting as much as you need but not too much.
Whereas I think in the past, people were erring, oh, it's just calcium magnesium, the more the merrier. It's inexpensive, let's just take a whole bunch of it. Right. Um, with calcium magnesium, you wanna make sure you have adequate vitamin D levels to ensure adequate absorption. And then vitamin K2, MK7, we'll talk about that a little later. Mm -hmm. That was our Today Special last weekend. But vitamin K2, MK7 wow. is the key to healthy calcium utilization. And what vitamin K2, MK7 does, in my mind, it allows you to get away with less calcium because it keeps the calcium where it's supposed to be, prevents it from going where it shouldn't go, so you get maximum value from the calcium that's already in your body and maximum value from the calcium that's in your diet or that you supplement. So again, with our calcium, it's designed to be more targeted. It's designed to deliver what you need at lower levels, highly bioavailable, so you get the benefit without having to take a handful of capsules or a bunch of big, as they, the big horse pills that are typical of calcium. And for so many of us, that's what we're doing, and we're not thinking a, a second thought about it. But the evidence and the facts are, if you're taking those rock-hard tablets, as Andrew shares with us, it's nowhere near as good or as effective as when it's like Andrew delivers it. But Andrew, again, the companies have not evolved. Well, I think, I think if you look at most of the products, many of them don't look very different from when I was a child, mm. um, which is fascinating. But say for our calcium product, the, the simple and most straightforward thing about our calcium product it's it's just an ultra fine cap powder in a small capsule right. so that powder dissolves instantly because the only thing you can expect from consuming a large tablet that basically calcium in a tablet is nothing more than a rock if you swallow a rock you can more or less expect that it's not going to be pleasant for your stomach and that's you usually get what you expect so with our with our calcium magnesium intensive care it's designed to be ultra soluble delivers what you need without you having to take again a handful of capsules so it's it's easier to be more intelligent about supplementation if you just make a small effort to inform yourself which is what i, I try to do here and what, what we can do online. We could do all sorts of research online. And our Monday night show, it's what I'm really trying to do because I have thousands of questions that have been asked. We, we see them all the time. To use these two hours here to answer the bulk of the questions. Because as I said before, one of the most common questions is, when do I take this? When do I take that? Can I take this but not take that at the same time? All of my products you could take at the same time. If there were an issue, we would tell you. These are not drugs, these are not medicines. These are exactly what the word says, dietary supplement. Yeah. What does supplement mean? Supplement is something that we add to something else. What is our diet? It is what we eat. These are ingredients that are present in our diet, but not in sufficient supply, so we choose to supplement them. Mm. So this is a dietary supplement of calcium magnesium because most of us don't eat adequate dairy, don't get adequate calcium magnesium. We've also been convinced we need to take enormous amounts in terms of supplements, which we do not. So this is just a dietary supplement. What was essential one? It was a dietary supplement of vitamins and minerals and carotenoids. So each product is very straightforward. You could take it with food whenever the meal works for you. They don't have special times. It doesn't make my products less sophisticated than the others. If anything, it makes them more sophisticated and more honest. You can take them whenever it works best for you. We're going to head over and talk about vitamin D3, and as we do, Andrew, one of the questions that um, I've been asked in the past is this idea of the expiration date. If we get to the expiration date on the product, does Good that question. mean it's got to be thrown away? That's another question I've, I've been asked countless times. With our products, the only thing that expiration date means is, is that's a time at which the potency could potentially begin to decline below the lo label potency. Okay. So meaning if we had a 2000 IU vitamin D3 and at three years, say you notice, wow, it's been in my cabinet for four years. It's the, it expired a year ago. If I take this, am I going to be taking any risks? Absolutely, positively, no risks at all. The only thing might, that might mean is that 2000 IU vitamin D3 capsule in a year past its expiration might be 700, 1750 or 1800 IU. It might have lost a bit of potency. It is not dangerous, it is not toxic, and none of those issues at all. These are not products that are going to be growing bacteria or fungus or somehow their ingredients become poisonous to you or toxic, not an issue at all. So again, that expiration date is just instructive in terms of potency, and if nothing else, it informs you 
that our products, when you receive them, they're years away from their expiration date. Although some of our products have shorter expiration dates, like Friendly Flora has an expiration date of just over a year, and we do that intentionally. But it just shows you when you get that product, they've all been freshly manufactured. We make all of our products, all our Today Specials, all of our visits, basically. Everything is made within weeks of that visit, everything. So I hope that answers the question, but again, a real good one. Now, yes. Andrew, if, if I could ask you to elaborate on what it says on the screen. On everybody's <laughs> TV screens at home, it says, the most important and the most affordable vitamin to consume, why? I always thought it was important to emphasize this about vitamin D. Sometimes if things are really inexpensive, we think they're not really important. We, we associate cost with benefit. Back in the day when CoQ10 was the most expensive nutrient I made, um, it was easy for people to understand how important <laughs> it was. Now I almost have to make an excuse for the fact that our CoQ10 is 90% less expensive than it was when I introduced it, that notwithstanding <laughs> the price reduction, it's still just as important as it was. Was. Vitamin D, as important as vitamin C is, as important as vitamin E, as important as B12, and those are sort of the three top uh, vitamins in terms of people supplementing them separately. As far as I'm concerned, vitamin D is even more important. That's why our multivitamin, we start with 1,000 or 2,000 IU of vitamin D3 in our essential mm -hmm. one, your choice because you don't want to be any lower than that. As I said before, I take about 4,000 IU per day, and that gets me to the level I need to be. And we should all have a blood test and know what our vitamin D levels are. I prefer vitamin D levels that are above 50, and preferably between 60 and 80. That would be ideal. Um, 50, 60, anywhere in there, that's, that's an excellent vitamin D level. That's generally going to require about 3,000, 4,000, 5,000 IU per day. If you're overweight, it requires more. And so with, with the graphic on the screen, it, it's just, despite how inexpensive vitamin D is, you could get that 2,000 IU capsule for pennies a day, pennies a day. It is still, if someone said to me, you're going to go through life and your which vitamin wouldn't you want to be sub-threshold? Wouldn't you want, would you, which vi vitamin would be most troubling to you based upon the science and research to be a bit lower than its healthy levels? And, and I would say vitamin D. Wow. That as healthy as vitamin C is, as important as vitamin E is, as important as vitamin vitamin B12 is to energy production, mm. um, I would still, vitamin D is that vitamin. That's the research and the science has been rolling, has been rolling and it's been sort of like a tsunami coming in for the last 15, 20 years. But mind you, it's a vitamin that I saw the research in epidemiologic studies, which I talked about how I love large population studies. More than laboratory studies, I like large population studies that talked almost 40 years ago of the importance of vitamin D in large populations. So since 1979, since I made my first multivitamin, I've been putting higher levels of vitamin D. Every multivitamin we've made has always had at least 1,000 IU right. of vitamin D3 in it. And most multivitamins had 200 or 400 for the better part of the last 35 years. Now some have bumped them up to 1,000. But it's something I've always recognized based on the science, because as I say, the science is what drives our formulas, not Nike economics, not the way everybody else does it, but the science that ensures that you're getting the best benefits. I know the pricing that you see on the screen, supremely affordable, not forgetting as well, as we head over to our next one, that while Andrew is here, we have and, that free shipping and, and handling. And sorry if we're going through no. tons of products here. <laughs> what, we're, what we're just trying to do is each product sort of serves as a reminder of questions mm. that are asked. And, and cholestic here, there's a tremendous amount of confusion when it comes to cholesterol. Right. And, and certainly cholesterol, as our levels get higher, certainly our LDL gets higher. And all of us should also, I talk about a vitamin D test, it would be great to have a more sophisticated cardiovascular risk profile performed, where you're looking at different levels. You're looking, say, at particle size mm -hmm. of your, your lipoproteins and things like that. You're looking at indices of inflammation. Very important to look at those sorts of things. There's a number of different providers that your doctor would know that would be very simple and straightforward to have that the additional testing done. And it's covered by insurance and things like that. But when it comes to cholesterol, cholesterol still has to take a back seat to managing our blood sugar, to managing our blood pressure, to, to managing our body weight. 
in, in terms of cardiovascular risk. But as our LDL gets higher, as our, and really our LDL gets higher, our HDL gets lower, as the ratios become less favorable, um, our risk for heart disease increases. A lot of folks take statin drugs, cholesterol-lowering right. drugs. They're, I think, among the most popular drugs in the world. Tens of billions of dollars a year sold. I think more, more business is done in cholesterol-lowering drugs than the entire vitamin <laughs> industry. So they're pretty popular. They're amazingly popular drugs. They're incredibly effective. They come with a long list of side effects. If you could limit their use, that would be great, and still achieve the goals of your physician, that would be great. Uh, one of the best things, Cholesticare, that is recognized by the Food and Drug Administration to lower total in LDL cholesterol are plant sterols. You take a capsule of this with each meal, you can expect a double-digit reduction in total in LDL cholesterol. Mm. Take two capsules, say, with a very large meal, but it's very simple, very affordable. It's an opportunity to significantly lower your total in LDL cholesterol. Statin drugs, if you're taking them, you need to take coenzyme Q10 because statin drugs lower cholesterol by acting as an HMG-CoA reductase inhibitor. It's a metabolic, it's an enzyme, it's a metabolic pathway in the liver that synthesizes a cholesterol, but it also synthesizes CoQ10. So when you take those cholesterol-lowering drugs, you're limiting the production of the most important arguably the most important energy producing molecule in your body. So it, that's at the top of the list of why there are all sorts of side effects associated with using statin drugs. Some great hints with statin drugs, if you use one with a longer half like, like, like Crestor, which is like at Resuvastatin, even Lipitor, um, if you use the, the longer half-life statin drugs, you could take them every other day, same dosage every other day, and pretty much be assured that you're not going to see a change in your cholesterol number, mm -hmm. meaning you just save money and also reduce the side effects and see about the same cholesterol reduction. There's all sorts of research. Your doctor can go to the, the, the National Research uh, Database and, and see that science. I'm sure your doctor's familiar with it. In most cases, you could have your dose, go every other day, and you will not see a significant increase in your total in LDL cholesterol. So there's all sorts of great things that can be done. That's not something the, the cholesterol-lowering drug manufa manufacturing companies promote. But there's ways to utilize these drugs, even Zetia, which is another cholesterol-lowering drug that works by a different mechanism. The standard dose is 10 milligrams. Five milligrams works just as well. In fact, I think all the VA hospitals, I think they, they announced to all their doctors that you prescribe five, not 10. Right. Reduces the cost in half, you get the same efficacy. So not that I profess to be prescribing drugs up here, it's not what I do, but to the extent you have to take them, this is a conversation to have with your doctor that could reduce your side effects, result in the same uh, reductions in cholesterol. And by adding cholesticare, all you do is ensure you'll get a better result or you can reduce the amount of the medication you're taking to achieve the same result. And again, it's approved by the U.S. Food and Drug Administration because it works and it works without side effect. And like all the products we've spoken about thus far, it's incredibly positively reviewed, meaning that people see the numbers. They see the difference in the numbers. And that is so key because it validates everything that's been said. We take a lot for granted with regards so many of you are Andrew's customers and fans for many, many years, but there's a lot of people out there that suffer with high cholesterol and they are looking for a natural uh, a tool to help well, fight some, it. This some it. folks can't take statin drugs at all. So, so this becomes an alternative increasing your fiber intake. If you take the fiber mucil along with cholesticare, it simply works better. But again, uh, there are all sorts of ways that the cholesterol-lowering drugs, there's great research on statin intolerant patients, on how your doctor can help you utilize them. It doesn't sound like me to tell someone how to use drugs, but there are ways to use those medications better to achieve the results you seek, because if your, your cholesterol numbers are unusually high, you definitely want to do your best to get them down. This is a great natural tool. Our Choco Nuvo, we'll talk about later, yes. contains the same ingredients, so a square of chocolate at every meal can lower your cholesterol 10, 15, 20% or more. We're going to head over to talk about something that Andrew's referred to a couple times, CoQ10. Andrew, yours is not like others. Is that a fair statement? Well, what's made our CoQ10 unique over the years has been originally the fact that it was 100% natural, its purity, its... And again, we started with CoQ10 back in 1984. Uh, CoQ10 is a relatively... Uh, new ingredient to most companies, I'd say, by new ingredient, I'd say the last 10 or 15 years. Uh, for me, it's an ingredient, how long ago was 1984? I guess that's 34 years. So we've been doing
doing CoQ10 since 1984. Um, and the one thing we learned about CoQ10 that even the best CoQ10 in the world, which is what we've always focused on, mm. but even the best CoQ10 in the world, you need to make sure, it's like I, I said this the other day, that no matter how important you are at your job or no matter how important you might be in your family, you can't be doing everything alone, that we all require the help of others. So no matter how much I can justify scientifically or biochemically why CoQ10 is the most central molecule we could ever contemplate supplementing to help us in terms of our energy metabolism, to help us in terms of our energy level, to help us in terms of optimum functioning of our key organs because our key organs are all about the efficiency of the energy they have available to them. But no matter how much I could argue that that ingredient is CoQ10, it would be naive and sort of foolish of me to just provide CoQ10. Because CoQ10 has other ingredients that are absolutely essential to its role in our body. And that's what we've done that's unique, is we make a product that's designed to ensure that CoQ10 performs at its optimum, maximum level. And if you read the reviews, our CoQ10 has over 95% positive reviews, I think about 85% five-star reviews. It truly is the most unique CoQ10 in the world simply because it works better. And if you are taking a CoQ10 product right now, maybe you went to the big box store and got a big a whole load of it, all we would ask you to do is compare Andrew's CoQ10 to that one, and I think you'll find a huge difference. We're going to go to the phones and say good evening and welcome to the Monday Night Show. Robin in Massachusetts, you're live with Adam and Andrew. Robin, welcome to the show. Hi, thank you. Hi, Robin. How are you? Hello. I'm well, thank you. Thanks good. to you. Oh, um, you're welcome. So I have a couple of questions. Sure. And first of all, I have to say that I love, love, love your products, and I could not live without them. Thanks. So I... Please never, never, never stop making them. I will not. Um, <laughs> the very first thing I ever tried um, was your original marine collagen peptide. Right. That was about nine years ago. Right. And I had no problem with the marine collagen, the original formula. Um, it's a little bit fishy, but I'm some people I'm telling you, do. I'm not exaggerating. The results were overnight. I had a tall glass of it with cold water before I went to bed. When I woke up the next morning, my skin looked radiant. Wow. And I couldn't believe I was hooked wow. then. So anyway, so I, I take great. a lot of your different products. My question is, sure. if I'm taking the um, essential vitamins, the multivitamins, right. do I still need to take an extra vitamin D and an extra calcium, magnesium, too? Or is the essential going to be enough for me? I do have a healthy diet. Um, I eat very healthy, a lot of, of salmon and greens. So I'm just wondering, do I still need those extra things separately? A great so question. A great question. What I would say is with the vitamin D, uh, depending on which essential one you're taking, we have a 1,000 IU or a 2,000 IU, um, typically what I say, the, the, the minimum levels of essential one to take daily are 1,000 or 2,000 IU. That's higher than the typical multivitamin provides. To, to achieve the best levels in terms of blood levels, I suspect you're going to find that the proper level for you is going to be between 3,000 and 4,000 IU. So I would likely recommend, if you chose to, taking a little bit more vitamin D because that will deliver you to that appropriate level. Uh, in terms of calcium and magnesium, unless, if you have a diet, if you eat dairy, if you have a diet that delivers adequate amounts of calcium magnesium, I'm not, I'm not the, the strongest advocate, absent some reason to do so, to supplement calcium and magnesium separately. So many doctors have recommended it, and that's why I make a calcium magnesium supplement. But if we have a diet that delivers calcium magnesium, then there's no real reason to supplement it separately. What I do recommend is vitamin K2 because whether we get calcium by our diet or whether we simply buy, get calcium by supplement or whether it's simply in our skeleton, we need to manage the calcium that's in our body to make sure it stays in our bones and it's delivered, it's not delivered in other tissues to calcify other tissues like our arteries and things. Uh, just uh, as far as the marine collagen, which you mentioned a moment ago, that's going to be our today's special with healthy hair, skin, and nails in July. Mm. So, oh, okay. so, I'll wait for it. so it'll be our today's special then. But to answer your question, 
I think if you're a doctor, if you did a blood test at your doctor's office, if you're taking 1,000 or 2,000 IU vitamin D, you're probably gonna find your level is around 30 or 35. Again, I prefer a level a little over 50, and, and that will require probably vitamin D supplementation more between 3,000 and 5,000 IU daily. Fortunately, vitamin D is incredibly affordable. So, and we also have a special vitamin D that's 3000 IU as well, which might suffice. So you could always reorder that formula. We don't speak about that on air, but it's available at hsn.com. Thank you. So. I do have one more question. Sure, Please. sure. Okay, um, do you think you'll ever make children's vitamins? Because I worry about my three and five year old granddaughters who are very picky eaters. You anticipated another question we'll be talking about, but both children's vitamins and pet vitamins will be coming. Uh, I don't want to make tablets because tablets require all sorts of additives, but what we will be doing is we'll be making little packets, like little sugar packets that in terms of pet vitamins will have a little bit of say a chicken or beef flavor added to it so our pets enjoy them. For children's vitamins, we won't be adding chicken or beef flavor. We'll <laughs> simply be having a nice fruit flavor with a natural sweetener without having any, sh without sugar, without calories, without any kind of artificial sweetener. But those are coming. I'm hoping they're going to be coming in the next six to nine months. So yes, both children's vitamins and pet vitamins will be coming. Both. Thank you, Robin, so much. We Thanks, appreciate Robin. your so call. Much. Oh, you're welcome. It's my pleasure. Thanks. We're going to head over this way. If cool. you would like to speak to Andrew live, it is 1-866-376-8255. Andrew, I think Robin speaks for a lot of and people with the pet and the children's vitamins. I really do. And what I also wanted to say before I forgot, I meant to say it before, um, all of our products go back to the HSN price between visits. Yes. And I just wanted to make sure everyone knew that we expended, extended the special pricing from this weekend. We extended it to until midnight, I think, tonight. So anything and everything that we make, because the, there was even a request on, on breast health, that it's uh, different products that we make that we don't talk about on TV very often, but all of the products are on their weekend special pricing. And so just to reiterate and to, to, to be really clear, we'll, we'll get through as much as we can in this show, but if you were considering buying anything from Andrew's line, that pricing is only now good until tonight. So they extended it for this extra 24 hours. So if you maybe were going to buy CoQ10 or you were going to buy Ultimate Women's Wellness or some marine collagen, anything that was on your uh, hit list to get, you can order it right now and be guaranteed of that free shipping and handling and of course the best pricing. For those asking about Choco Nouveau, we have the final presentation until October coming up in our next hour. That will be your last chance to be able to get Choco Nouveau for this year, you can pre-order it if you'd like. We're going to spend a little bit of time talking about uh, Andrew's Omega product, uh, a legendary product in the we, line, there's no doubt. Well, we just did a, a today's special for this <laughs> a week ago, but I just wanted to mention it because it's an important mm -hmm. constituent of our, our product line, and, and a lot of folks might have missed it. It's probably one of the, as you said, sort of legendary products in that it, um, Omegas have gotten a really bad rap over the years, a really bad reputation because they're unpleasant, they're, they're hard to swallow, huge capsules, they, they have an unpleasant aftertaste, they can make you nauseous, they make some people vomit, they mm. just a long list of fishy aftertaste, long list of unpleasant problems, all of which we have entirely eliminated. So our Omega-3 delivers all of the benefits you seek from an Omega-3 product, but does it in a small capsule that's ultra concentrated that will not cause any stomach upset. It has no fishy aftertaste at all. Even if you open the capsule, you're not going to notice a fishy taste or a fishy aroma because it's been entirely neutralized. So it's a very unique product. It's part of the question when people ask, when should I take my vitamins? Right. You take this with a meal, you could even take it on an empty stomach. It will still be well absorbed and it will not cause an upset stomach. But again, ideally you take your fats with a meal because that's when all of the digestive processes are stimulated to, enjoy, and to absorb those fats best. And our goal, of course, is to absorb the contents of a nutritional supplement. So best to take it with a meal. Uh, this is also a great combination with CoQ10 because CoQ10's absorption is enhanced in the presence of fat, which is another reason why we always want to take CoQ10 with a meal because every meal contains traces of fats, even if you're on a fat-free diet, which is not a good idea because I'm someone who is a big fan of fat in our diet, but healthy fat. Uh, I'm not a big fan of sugar and carbohydrate necessarily, especially processed foods, mm. because even I was just reading some research today where almost all of the maladies of our society 
if you look at folks who eat a, a more heavily processed diet, we think, okay, a more heavily processed diet, they're gonna have an increased risk of heart disease and things like that, right. increased risk of obesity, type two diabetes, of course, of course, that's the case. But even things like depression, those of us who eat a more heavily processed diet, we have an increased risk of, risk of depression. So it's really in our best interest to eat more fruits, more vegetables, more healthy sources of protein, and not be afraid of healthy fats because again, our brain is by weight two thirds fat. And the mo most predominant fat in our brain is the most predominant fat in our omega-3. It's not the most predominant fat in the typical omega-3, but it is in ours. So we can't be afraid of fat because being afraid of fat means that the most important ingredient, as we talked about in terms of our eyes, in terms of our brain, it's the omega-3 fatty acid, DHA, the CASA hexanoic acid, which is the predominant ingredient in this product. And, and Andrew's words there are very powerful and it is hard to hear because there are some of us who have tried an Omega product and we don't like it, we don't like the taste, we don't like how it repeats on us. But then when Andrew says that what's in his product is different to what typically we're used to taking, that is a hard pill, no pun intended, to swallow. The reality is, and, and I know this is, gives Andrew the most amount of joy, is literally to be stood here imparting this information to you. It's valuable stuff. No, I mean, I just, I hadn't taken my Omega-3 today. I just grabbed a capsule. I wonder, I and, saw. And so, and it's, it's, it's not something that I'd even give a second thought. When I first tested this product to make sure that it didn't repeat, because I'm someone who a standard Omega-3 product, mm. it would be, it would not be pretty. And, and that's one of those things that I'm sort of the guinea pig for our products because if a supplement is going to be difficult to, to swallow or difficult on a stomach, I'll be the first person to, to be a witness to it. But I could take a handful of this on an empty stomach and I won't even remember I did. Right. Because typically the way I remembered I took my vitamins before I started making vitamins is I just thought how my stomach mm -hmm. felt. Because after I got done taking vitamin tablets before I started making the capsules that you see here, invariably it upset my stomach. I had to plan my vitamins around my workout because I didn't want it to interfere with my workout. Uh, our vitamins are designed to be gentle. Every product is designed to be gentle, not to those of us or most of us, but to even those of us with the most sensitive stomachs. They're designed to be mild, gentle, so everyone can take advantage and benefit. If you'd like to order yours, please feel good about um, uh, people that have come before you and given this nearly 3,000 reviews, which is just a humongous number. We're gonna head over this way and- I, I suspect if we added up the reviews just in the couple of dozen products in this hour, <laughs> we're probably somewhere around 25,000 reviews. And, and I would also imagine that about 85% of them are five-star reviews agree. and over 90% are positive. Which, I mean, you know, we at HSN are always excited to see any reviews, but most products typically have five to ten reviews. Andrews has thousands upon thousands. Tens um, of thousands. Tens of thousands. Yes. A hundred thousand we're, probably a film of the lifetime. We're getting close to a hundred thousand reviews, I Gosh. suspect. So, um, but the most exciting part is, is the fact that, that those reviews are an opportunity for you to get an opinion other than ours. Yeah. Uh, certainly you go online and do research, but how how beneficial is it to get insights? I love if we're going, if Muriel and I are going to, if we're going to the movies, if right. we're gonna read a right. book, if we're going to go to a new restaurant, we love to read reviews. And you wanna see like a few dozen reviews to make sure that you get a good sampling. How exciting is it for you to know that, say on a product like this, vitamin K2, MK7, a relatively new product, I suspect there's already a couple hundred reviews on this product. Right. And this product has really not been featured all that much. It was just a Today Special last weekend. Yeah. But it's, it's one of the most important products. In fact, one of the most common questions I've been asked, if you're taking blood thinners, mm -hmm. because vitamin K1 is the, is the vitamin that directly relates to blood clotting. Vitamin K2 is not related to blood clotting. Um, this product has 100 milligrams of vitamin K2, has a small amount of vitamin K1, only 50 micrograms. Show it to your doctor, it should not be problematic at all in terms of if you're on a, a clotting drug like Coumadin or Warfarin. The new class of clotting drugs, you don't have to be concerned about vitamin K, which a lot of people are being switched to the new class, mm. new classes of clotting drugs. I think there's four of them out there now. So it, it's something that vitamin K is unfortunately related to the vitamin K1 in terms of name, 
but it shouldn't be because its function is entirely different. In fact, I'm actually thinking in the future of redoing all of our K2 formulas. We have a 50, a 100, and a 200. Um, this is the 100, this is what I take. Um, the, I'm thinking of removing the little bit of K1. It's just a tiny bit of K1 that's in them. I'm thinking of removing it just so it doesn't even have to be a thought or a consideration in terms of the, the issue of how it might interact with a clotting medication. We got some questions as well, Andrew, regarding um, taking different vitamins and them having a cancelling out effect on other ones. How do we respond to that? Yeah, I'm, I'm not aware of any product I make that cancels out another product at all. Um, there are a lot of sort of, I'm not sure if I'd call them old wives tales or right. things like that, that certain vitamins have a, an adverse impact on other vitamins or will interfere with their absorption. That if you take calcium magnesium in the presence of our fiber, if you take our omega-3s in presence of our fiber mucil, it will interfere with its absorption. Uh, there is no science that I'm aware of that would validate or support that at all. Um, and if anything, a fiber-rich diet is not associated with reduced um, nutrient intake. And if it was, I would still eat a fiber-rich diet because a fiber-rich diet is most, one of the most important things we could do. We're not talking about fiber right now, but it's one of the most important things we could do in terms of our colon health, in terms of our overall health, because a more fiber-rich diet is a diet that's associated with lower levels of cholesterol, associated with all sorts of redu reduced risks of, of other health issues. So fiber is an important part of a healthy diet. It's not a typical part of a processed food diet the way we eat in America. Not a typical part of a diet that's rich in animal product because there's no fiber in animal products. But before we run along on vitamin K2, MK7, I spoke about it a bunch last weekend. But whether you supplement calcium, whether you get your calcium from your diet, or whether you're just getting along with the calcium that's already in your bones, um, vitamin K2, MK7 is just like vitamin D. I have been saying this since we introduced K2, MK7. It's probably Probably the most underestimated of vitamins in terms of its overall importance mm -hmm. to our long-term health and because managing calcium keeping it in our bones that's all about over the course of our lifetime avoiding osteoporosis osteopenia and having mm -hmm. a strong healthy skeleton so it's great to keep it in our bones also keeping it out of arterial tissues and other tissues avoiding that calcification is also part of reducing over the course of our lifetime our risk of heart disease so we want to manage our calcium effectively. The latest research on vitamin K2, MK7, says it's an integral part of how our body manages calcium, keeps it where it's supposed to be, avoids it going to where it shouldn't go. It's available again, special pricing only until midnight. We're gonna head over this way. If you're still thinking about what maybe you could be adding to your daily routine, uh, if my mom was here, she would be absolutely happy to talk your ear off about circulation and vein support. Every time my mom visits from England, and she takes back with her some circumvent support. Uh, for many of you, I know there she's would be... Sm a she's smuggling it back to the UK. <laughs> Don't tell anybody, Andrew, please. <laughs> um, for anybody that takes this, you know that you would riot if Andrew ever stopped making it. Andrew, this is a, this gets banded around a lot, but a life-changing product for so many. It, it truly is. Well, and, and I can't take credit for it. The credit really goes to the other side of the ocean. The original folks who developed this product were some... Um, uh, clinical researchers, some physicians in France uh, that go back now about 75 or 80 years. And, and this was a very popular ingredient, the key ingredient diosmin in this product, going back um, into Europe. And it's something that I was aware of in Europe, but um, it was not available here. In Europe, it's actually prescribed as a medication. Um, it's a natural ingredient here. Of course, we don't make medical claims or anything like that for it. It's a natural ingredient that delivers the, the benefits in terms of healthy circulation, supporting healthy circulation in our legs. And, a difference you could see, a difference you can feel. Um, it's a product you don't see this ingredient, unfortunately, in supermarkets or discount stores. You really don't see it anywhere. You can maybe find diosmin on the internet, but I, I wonder if it's really from a reliable source or not. What's sort of amusing, we've gotten a few callers who remind me, there's, there's a, another um, small shopping channel that what apparently someone was on there <laughs> doing a circulation product. And I'm just speaking to this, not out of any respect to the person who was talking very disrespectful about this product and me, 
but just so not to worry, you don't have to come to my defense, I'm fine, <laughs> that the only reason that product exists on that other network is they were copying mine. So that's the only reason that product exists. They were just copying it. Five years ago, 10 years ago, 15 years ago, that doctor had never heard of this ingredient probably ever before. There but regardless, if he's copied my product, what do they say? That's the in imitation, imitation is the sincerest form of flattery. So he should have stopped there mm. instead of disparaging me or disparaging our product. Uh, but I think this product, I don't think their product has a single review. And this product has several thousand so I think your vo voices speak very loudly. The fact that we were responsible for bringing this ingredient to the United States over 20 years ago after finding it in Europe and going through all the steps of bringing this natural ingredient here, uh, I think that speaks for itself. So, so don't worry, I appreciate that everyone was coming to my defense, but, but I just kind of smiled when I heard that and, and uh, I appreciate that. But we, we know the quality of our product uh, and it's designed specifically so it could be a daily use product and you could take it and derive the benefits and not have any worries or risks. A profound difference and a profound Life-changing product. I mean, yeah. I, I wrote down here because review after review after review, feet, ankles, calves, swelling, appearance of blood vessels. This is a, a, a daily occurrence that somebody is going online and writing a which, review, adding towards these, you know, 2,000 reviews so and far. And we only have a few hundred bottles of this left, by the way. I just noticed oh, we've, boy. we've gone through so many bottles this weekend that's only a few hundred bottles left. But it is a product that... Just basically, if your legs, feet, ankles, calves don't feel or look the same as they did 5, 10, 15, 20, 30, 40 years ago, if at the end of the day you can't wait to elevate them, if they're tingling, if they, if they just have that restless feeling, like mm -hmm. if I go for a long bike ride, that's what I used to feel at the end of the day, which this has eliminated. For all of us, you know, it's our own individual experience, but this is a product that can make a profound difference. The clinical science is abundantly strong, and as strong as the clinical science is on diosmin, the science on butcher's broom extract, which we added to the product a couple of years ago, would make it almost an equivalent standalone product. Instead, we deliver both together to make this really an unparalleled product that there's no product like it anywhere in the world. And you look at the quality of the reviews on this product, how unanimously positive they are, and I think you'd want to give it a try. It's effective. And I mean, you know, naturally, a lot of us are very skeptical of things that we see, especially on television. The reality, and Andrew, you know that. No, I mean, I, I feel as though, and that's why I love the reviews and I love taking the quotes from the science during my shows, because I feel that I, as much as I can say something with conviction, you shouldn't have to take my word for it. So I love the fact that the reviews are there. I love the fact that on this product, we have at least 100 quotes quotes from clinical studies and research studies talking about the benefits and the efficacy, what was observed using the ingredients here. So it's something that uh, we, it's, for me, it's always a patient process. Mm -hmm. I try not to go on air and, and really ever, quote, sell something, that my, my goal is to simply inform and educate. And when you feel as though you know enough or you've learned enough, um, then that's up to you if you want to try a product. And of course, the one thing we always do here Ever since I first set foot on, on QVC, what it was almost 30 years ago, um, I've always insisted that you love the product or you send it back for a complete refund. Right. And when I first uh, got on air, both at QVC and HSN, both networks were worried that as much as I talk about our re the refund, and if you don't love it, send it back, that we'd be getting huge amounts of product back. And in fact, we, we were at QVC, and we still are here at HSN, the lowest return rate products by far. So what I'm proud of is the products work. You could read the reviews to understand that. And if a product didn't work, if it didn't get good reviews, mm -hmm. the only thing I would do, it, I'd, I'd make it disappear. Mm -hmm. We either fix it so it satisfies you or we stop making it. Yeah, I mean, it is at the heart and soul of everything Andrew does. And that's why I say this every time whenever I'm here with Andrew, there is a... I don't know, maybe an air of confidence when I get to talk about these things with him because of you, because the reality and the facts are the facts. They're all amazing. They're all the best you can buy. Nothing is kind of substandard, subpar, simply the best vitamins in the world. And that's why we're excited. And it's kind of fun for me too, with this product especially, um, I appreciate that everyone came to my defense. That was very, very they nice. We, we had multiple calls at, at, at the company, at ProCaps, um, and uh, saying that someone was saying bad things about me and bad things about our product. So I, I appreciate that, and I, we're, I'm capable of taking care of myself, but I really appreciate that everybody was, uh, was 
coming out and supporting me. That was very nice. Well, I'm glad you feel good. Andrew addressed the elephant in the room because the reality <laughs> is we were talking about it backstage. It was a thing. No, it's it's there's there's no reason that anyone. I mean, if if they if they think this is a great product and they see how popular it is and they're on another network, they're they're free to try to make their best version of that product. I applaud them validating the fact that we make a product that's a very good product. There's no reason to disparage someone. Right. There's no reason to disparage the product. Right. And that's the, the same thing. In fact, when I talk about Centrum or One a Day. Mm -hmm. um, I wonder why they still put artificial colors in their products. As far as their products, you know, they're as I've said, they're better than nothing. But we, I objectively go through the levels in their products, mm -hmm. and I objectively talk about artificial colors that most consumers. Mm -hmm. I think if you look at a, a food stores like Whole Foods and a few others, they refuse to sell products that have artificial colors. Right. So, so it's one thing to sort of give a, a critical assessment of something based upon sort of an objective characteristic. It's another thing to sort of personally attack something. <laughs> well, we'll, we'll say this as we said at the beginning, imitation is the best or almost a serious form of flattery. Yes. And that's what people are trying to do because they know that yes. Andrew makes the best. Well, that's, that's our goal. And, and there are, I mean, we are not the only company in the world that makes quality supplements. Um, for a long time, um, we were the only company that aspired in certain categories like CoQ10 or Omega-3s or things like that. But when it comes to vitamins, most companies, they don't make any of their products. Right. So even if they have the intention of creating something special, they're relying on a third party manufacturer, a contract manufacturer to do it. And kind of that's the rub. That's where things sort of disconnect when someone else is trying to do the work for you. As you know, it's sort of when it comes to home cooking, the special ways you do things, only you do those things. It's very hard to find someone else who's going to give the same attention to detail. And when I originally started my company, I had no intention of making products. I had every intention of designing amazing products. Right. But what I quickly found out, I could design amazing products, but no one could make amazing products. So <laughs> then I was forced to have to, and it was very, very difficult. I was forced to make the products myself. And initially, for the first, say, seven or eight years, maybe longer, that my company existed, anyone who was getting my products, I was making them. I made every <laughs> single product. I made the capsules. I put the capsules in the bottle. So for until, say, about 30 years ago, every product that my company was made by me. You talk about something that we feature, certainly on the Monday night show, American Dreams. Andrew is the embodiment of an American dream. <laughs> it's, it's been a long time. So it seems like it was yesterday, but it's hard to believe that it was now 39 years ago, 39 years ago, that I put vitamins in my first bottle of products. Um, so it's, it's pretty wild. And, that uh, and would it be fair to say, I mean, knowing you like I do, that today your drive and I'm, I'm passion for it is the same, if not more than it was even 39 it's years ago? definitely not the same. I'm more excited, more impassioned, um, and I say this all the time, I'm having more fun doing my job than I've ever had it, that I Shows. see greater opportunity to provide products that make a profound difference in people's lives right. than ever before. Just even to think now that we've figured out how to do pet vitamins, how to do children's vitamins, because we were not gonna make tablets. I couldn't do things that added more additives. So I'd rather not make a product than make a product that was like everyone else's. It's a wholesome message, there's no doubt. Uh, just real quick, and then we're gonna go to the phones. A quick introduction on glucosamine, because this is another big one for a lot of us. Healthier joints, better flexibility, a great item. It's, it's another product that when we first introduced this, one of my first product was a glucosamine product back in 1979. Wow. So we've known about glucosamine, or I've known about glucosamine for a long time. One of the unfortunate things is as an ingredient becomes more and more popular, and as the public decides to adopt this ingredient and adopt its benefits, the unfortunate thing that happens is that all of a sudden people start taking shortcuts. Right. So all of a sudden it's not good enough to follow the research and make a glucosamine sulfate, chondroitin sulfate product. People have to start using glucosamine hydrochloride. Doesn't have the science, doesn't have the benefits, mm. but it's basically about half as expensive. So all of a sudden it looks like someone's selling a really affordable bottle of glucosamine. But you have to read the fine print on the back to realize it's not glucosamine sulfate, it's glucosamine HCL. Or they do a blend and it will say glucosamine HCL and sulfate and it's 99% 
HCL and only 1% sulfate. So this is one of those products that what is the Latin thing, caveat emptor, buyer beware, that you have to become good at reading labels, mm. that there still are glucosamine sulfate, chondroitin sulfate products you could find that have the proper forms. Unfortunately, most chondroitin is the sodium salt of chondroitin. For those of us who are watching our sodium levels, you don't want extra sodium coming from your supplement because it's typically not declared on the label. We use the calcium and potassium salts, so the calcium chondroitin sulfate and potassium glucosamine sulfate. So you get electrolytes, minerals that are desirable and you're not getting additional sodium. So there's more than meets the eye with the typical glucosamine chondroitin supplement. And again, typical in the reviews on our product, uh, that you'll, and this is a lot of the questions are asked that I take other people's glucosamine, it doesn't work, why will yours work? Ours will work because it's the form that follows the science. Theirs didn't work because it wasn't the proper form. Typically also glucosamine chondroitin are in tablets, hard to tolerate, hard to swallow, don't necessarily fully dissolve, aren't necessarily delivering their ingredients fully available. So we again, ultra fine powder in a capsule delivers everything you need, everything you want without stomach upset or any problems at all. And don't forget we have that special pricing through till midnight tonight. Let's head over this way. Andrew Turmeric, just before we speak to, I think it's Juanita who's gonna be on the phone. Why your turmeric? Lots of people love the idea of turmeric. What can it do for well, us? The turmeric, the, the, for the same reason, our turmeric for the same reason since we introduced turmeric over a decade ago, turmeric is something that everyone's recently discovered. But turmeric was something I was aware of for a long time. In fact, we had traces of turmeric in our products as many as 20 years ago. The reason why I didn't do a standalone separate turmeric product was I wasn't ready to do it until we figured out how to overcome the absorption problem. That was the problem with turmeric. Right. I wasn't confident in turmeric until we figured out how to overcome absorption. In food, we overcome absorption issues by complexing it, cooking it with fat. But also in food, the standardized the turmeric is only about 1% curcuminoids. Curcuminoids are what makes turmeric beneficial. There's a broad class of compounds in turmeric that are beneficial. We talk, it, talk in terms of standardization for those curcuminoids. Unfortunately, typical spices are one to 3%. Our turmeric in this product is 95%, but we complex it with fat, phosphatidylcholine, to ensure its absorption. If you're not ensuring its absorption, unfortunately, turmeric is not going to be delivering its benefits. So the idea of being more soothing, detoxifying, there's so many reasons why folks love the turmeric. We'd love to send you a bottle of Andrew so you can start to feel the benefits. We're gonna go to the phones though and say good evening to Juanita in South Carolina. Juanita, welcome to the Monday Night Show. You're live with Adam and say hi to Andrew. Hello, Andrew. How are you doing this evening? I'm great, Juanita. How are you? I am doing just fine, sir. Great. And I thoroughly, thoroughly love your products. Thank you. Thanks. Great. And um, Andrew, tonight I have a question about sure. Atsazanthin. Mm -hmm. um, you spoke about it with the Ultimate Eye products uh, right. for this past weekend on um, today's special. Right. And um, I use the Ultimate Eye support, and I have been uh, waiting for your today's special to get the 720 caps. Right. And um, I purchased the bundle. Right. And um, I read the reviews on HSN, right. and I Googled the product to get more information. Right. And I'm used to trusting the education that you give with your products. Right. And I would like to um, have more information about the benefits of astaxanthin. And Juanita, by the way, and I was thinking about this today after having done the Today Special the day before on Ultimate Eye with astaxanthin, thinking, you know, I didn't talk enough about astaxanthin on its own. So th thanks for reminding me. And what astaxanthin is? Astaxanthin is a, a carotenoid like lutein and like zeaxanthin. It, it shares a very common structure. Uh, it's really not available from our diet because it's typically found in wild salmon, which is very difficult to find and very expensive most of the year. Um, astaxanthin is the pigment that makes flamingos pink, or when we see that pinkish orange color on lobster or crab, that's astaxanthin. Um, astaxanthin, the bulk of the research on astaxanthin has to do with visual accommodation. And even when you read the reviews on astaxanthin, what it talks about a lot is fatigue, eye fatigue. So 
I'm someone who spends way too much time looking at my computer. So astaxanthin is something for me that I feel has made a difference in the way my, my eyes accommodate that working close for hours at a time and then being able to refocus on things that are further away. Um, I think in terms of eye fatigue or just eye strain that I typically had, I feel that astaxanthin has made a difference in the way I experience those things after do doing too much work in front of a computer monitor or spending too much time looking at a smartphone. So that's where we see most of the science and research. A lot of the research out of Asia in terms of video display terminal usage. So if you're someone who spends a lot of time uh, reading electronic devices, reading books, it, doing a lot of close work, then astaxanthin is great for that kind of eye fatigue or what they call the accommodation that our eyes, the eye, our eyes have to accommodate the work we give it. And when we're doing a lot of close work and then we expect our eyes to work fine from far away as well, that's a lot of accommodation work that astaxanthin, also lutein and zeaxanthin, but astaxanthin has been shown to be particularly effective at. So I'm not sure if does, what, do you do work that requires you spend a lot of time in front of a computer or things like that? Yes, I do. Well, well, then astaxanthin is probably going to be something that, that works well for you. What were you hoping that astaxanthin would provide in addition to the ultimate eye? Well, just more benefits. Okay. I, I, I love the, the benefits that I've gotten from the um, ultimate eye. It's right. like, I feel like a stalker looking for you to be selling it at, at the, the uh, today's special price. Right. <laughs> and um, so I was hoping that with the astaxanthin, with the great improvements that I have received already, that the astaxanthin would give me even more. And um, so that, that's basically what it is. I just wanted to understand more about the product itself right. and how it would affect my eyes above the, um, the benefits that I've already received right. from the ultimate eye. Well, I think if you're like me and like so many others, having, you've, having read the reviews, I think you will. That ultimate eye, ultimate eye is a, sort of a, a vision changing product uh, and I think astaxanthin as I've said ultimate eye is the perfect foundation and astaxanthin is sort of the icing on the cake so I'm not sure if we got the oh, we didn't oh, we did get the graphics up for astaxanthin or ultimate eye on the screen there so yeah I'm sure you'll you'll love it Juanita and, and that's that's a, a really great question because I actually thought about it afterwards saying I got so excited and carried away with ultimate eye I didn't spend enough time on astaxanthin so thanks for making me do so great question well, thank, thank you Juanita so all right, thanks, Juanita. If you would like to do what Juanita's done and called in, it's 1 376 8255. If you'd like to order the astaxanthin, it is 095004, your item number. We're going to head this way um, to like a mini segment now, Andrew. These are two that I've started to take since you presented them with me about a year ago now. They don't often got, get a lot of airtime. That was the only time I ever saw them. Yeah, these are products that what I often talk about are the importance that. I think the healthiest fruits, um, all fruits are healthy, uh, but certainly the fruits that we talk about as delivering the greatest amount of protective compounds are the berries. Mm. Um, and especially those red and purple colored bells. I just yesterday talked about ultimate eye, and I talked about the anthocyanins in bilberry and black elder as being critical for night vision and cr critical protective compounds throughout our body. So fruitful antioxidants are built about around those natural colored compounds that we find in the healthiest of fruits. Cruciferous extracts are, are built around the glucosinolates that are the compounds that make cruciferous vegetables so healthy. So we take the healthiest vegetables, which are cruciferous, the healthiest fruits, which are the red colored berries and other fruits, and I'll go down a list of each, and just what's always fun to do on the fruit. We don't make this product so it's colorful. We right. don't make it so it's a, like a food dye. But if I open this one capsule, and put it, and this is Watch more this. than a gallon of water here. Yep. And if we put that one capsule in a gallon of water, and mind you, again, this is not something that's designed to be food color, but we'll just stir it, and in literally in a matter of Glorious. moments, it becomes pretty much almost opaque. Yep. And it will get darker and darker. But those are the, the power of the protective compounds, the anthocyanins that are present in fruitful antioxidants. And it's not just a bunch of dried fruit. These are each fruit, and I'll you look at the chart here, that are standardized extracts going down the list from three different sources of acai berry to 25 and 10 percent anthocyanin extracts of bilberry, 15 and 30 percent of black elder, cranberry, grape skin, pomegranate. Each, each one has its declared 
extract level. Blueberry extract, cherry extract, chokeberry extract, grapeseed extract, raspberry extract, resveratrol, 20 milligrams, there you go. strawberry extract, blackberry extract, apple for polyphenols at 75%, and then a little bit of vitamin C. So you're getting a product that is a cross-section. There's no additives, there's no binders, there's no fillers or flow agents or lubricants. It's just all extracts of some of the healthiest fruits that could be imagined. And if you look at the color now, yeah. it's, it's, that's one capsule in over a gallon of water. I was just gonna say, just from one capsule, look at the strength no, of the color. It's pretty amazing. If you are somebody that doesn't, and you knowingly don't eat enough fruits or vegetables, these two items are absolutely a must and, have. And I think, they're, are they, I think they're both the same price. I believe so. so. Whether you choose the, the fruitful antioxidant extracts or you choose the cruciferous yes. extracts, yes. they're both the same price for the, so whatever you choose, they're the same price for the same sizes. And the cru cruciferous extracts, I could show everyone here. Please. We look at the healthiest, some of the healthiest vegetables, um, broccoli, yeah. red cabbage actually, which also has an anthocyanin standardization. We have mustard seed extract, wasabi extract, mm. which wasabi, the Japanese spice, who knew wasabi is a cruciferous vegetable. I had no idea. Brussels sprouts extract and kale extract. So each capsule delivers not less than 8,000 micrograms of glucosinolates. Right. So what we've tried to do here, for me, oops, for me, when I, what I'll do is on days where I have an abundance of cruciferous vegetables, I don't have a cruciferous extract capsule. When I don't, that's when I have a capsule of it. And the same thing with the fruitful antioxidant extracts. They become my dietary supplement yep. when my diet needs to be supplemented for each of those individual compounds. Cannot recommend this enough. And I, I don't think a day goes by when I eat enough cruciferous vegetables. So I'm taking this on a daily basis. Truly, truly a wonderful product. Again, uh, I know for many of you, you might never have tried Andrew's vitamins or supplements. These are easy on the stomach and absolutely a pleasure to enjoy. Um, if you can, I would do both. They are on FlexPay. Uh, just about good health. I mean, I'm it's just funny. drinking it straight just, from the jug. I just, I just <laughs> wanted to taste it. And it tastes just like unsweetened fruit punch. I need so, a glass. And drinking need... from, it's, it's about a, it? yeah, it's, it's heavy. That's more than a gallon. So that weighs. Uh, Don't judge me. <laughs> yes. <laughs> No, take the whole thing. Chug it. <laughs> yeah. It just tastes like unsweetened fruit punch. And that's one capsule in, in more than a, a gallon of water there. It's that's fantastic. A, and it's, it reminds me of the old, uh, old Kool-Aid commercials. Yes. It's the, the shape. Did they have Kool-Aid in the yeah, UK? Yeah, they did indeed. Well, so it looks like the same shape. It you just the, yeah. had the smiley face on it. Yes. <laughs> we'll add that for next time. Uh, we are limited in this one. It's something that doesn't get a lot of air time on HSN, but certainly we're thrilled that we're able to do it. Um, if you want the fruitful antioxidants, it's there in all the different sizing. Um, can we spend just a few moments on the, uh, okay, fabulous, we are gonna do that. Um, there we go. Andrew, this again oh. for the price point, so valuable. Oh no, what we, what we now have up there is another graphic on another product called Green Foods Complex, oh. because a lot oh. of folks oh. confuse the cruciferous extracts with our Green Foods Complex. Cruciferous extracts are standardized extracts from cruciferous vegetables, standardized, standardized for their most important compound, which is glucosinolates. What our green foods extract is, a lot of folks had asked me to do a green foods drink. We'll probably be able to do one in the future because I now have a way, we'll do an unsweetened version, we'll have a way to sweeten it naturally uh, without sugar and without anything synthetic, anything artificial. But our green foods, we created a capsule. So we created a green food capsule that focuses on the most important of the green foods. So you have your blue green algae, you have your, your chlorella, you also have your barley grass, and you also have wheat grass. So, and it's of course gluten free. So that's a product I haven't spoken about on television probably for five or six years. But it's just, a lot of folks confuse, they look at the cruciferous vegetable product as sort of a green product, right. but it's cruciferous vegetables. These are the, the green foods. When you look at green drinks and things like that, that's often what the ingredients that you're looking at. So would it- so Barley grass, wheat grass, chlorella, blue green algae. So it would be fine spirulina. to get both of these? Yes, absolutely. They're both very different products. 
Well, I didn't even know this existed. Right. Perhaps you're like me. That's fact. So when we see all the green drinks, these healthy green drinks, these are some of the core ingredients. Typically, yes. And sometimes now they're putting in some, some dried kale or dried spinach or things like that. But when it comes to those vegetables, uh, for me, they need to be standardized. So you're actually getting the beneficial compounds from those vegetables right. and not just dried spinach or dried kale. Right. When it comes to our green food complex, those are very expensive ingredients. When you, you get the, the chlorella that we use, the spirulina that we use, the wheat and barley grass that we use and again it's even though it says wheatgrass it's a hundred percent like all of my products are 100 percent gluten-free all of our products are non-gmo that's something that we're very very of course careful about that's a fabulous one only a couple hundred of those if you'd like to try it and um, again we invite you to go online we'll head over if you and go to hsn.com you'll see all the entire assortment and, and what we'll probably do with our green foods is we'll take that same blend and we'll put it in a free flow powder so you could either add it to a smoothie and it will be unflavored so it won't be tasty right or we'll be adding our this new natural ingredient we have which is going to be our own little sort of a, a natural sweetener that's uh, a good natural sweetener without any of the nasty things we don't want exciting things to come we're going to yes. spend um, some time on vitamin c this will just be a uh, it's just we're often asked about the, the separate vitamins we make. Right. Um, and we should probably even get the graphic up for, you know, our B12-250. Yes. If we can find our B12-250. Um, because the, the separates that most people reach for, uh, of course, vitamin K2, MK7, of course, vitamin D, um, but vitamin C. Vitamin C remains one of the most popular separate vitamins. I think we've become a little blasé about it, a little accustomed to it, but there's, there is still an abundance, tens of thousands of studies talking about the, the benefits that vitamin C plays, and also talks about how we have in, inadequate levels of vitamin C in our diet, unfortunately. Our vitamin C, non-acidic, won't upset your stomach, unlike other vitamin C products, mm. and it's also incredibly, incredibly affordable, as you could see, just pennies a capsule, despite being 500 milligrams of vitamin C and non-acidic. Andrew, we had a question regarding um, if I'm, oh no, hold that question, we're gonna to go to the phones. Okay. It's Mary in Arizona. Mary, welcome to the show, you're live with Adam. Say hi to Andrew. Hi, hi Andrew. Hi, Mary, so happy how, to talk to you. How are you? Watching, you. oh, I'm okay. Great. Um, I had a really easy question for you to answer. Okay, good, I'm I glad, I like easy questions. Following. Excuse me? Sometimes, at night especially. And I wondered if I could just open the capsule uh, I take most everything you have, but can I just open the capsules and put them in a glass of water Absol and drink the water? Absolutely. You could put it in a glass of water, a glass of juice, you could put it in yogurt, you could put it into, uh, say, cereal like oat bran or oatmeal. Absolutely. Not a problem Any at all. Any one of them? Doesn't matter what it is? I'm trying to think, well, soft gel capsules that have an oil in it like omega-3, you couldn't do it with an omega-3 capsule or something like right. that. But in terms of the others, like our Essential One multivitamin, um, they all, some like turmeric or others might have a certain flavor or taste, like our ginger extract. So sure. depending, which products are you talking about? Oh, well, mostly it's the fiber mucil. Right. And anything that's a larger capsule, a little bit larger. <coughs> Excuse small, me. But Excuse me. sometimes my throat doesn't, so... Yeah, I would say that with fiber mucil, certainly, I mean, our capsules, we try to keep them small. That's a yeah, single zero right. capsule with fiber mucil. But uh -huh. I would say that that's not a problem at all because especially the fiber in fiber mucil is an ultra fine powder. So yeah. you could mix, you can mix fiber mucil. We do this at home. We'll mix fiber mucil in with our oatmeal or our oat bran. So you can mix it with yogurt. You can mix it with water. You can mix it with tea. So you could feel free opening them up. A lot of people, it's just, they, they don't want to be swallowing capsules. So they just open the capsules up and, and swallow the powder instead. But you could do that be because also there's no additives. So every product you get is just 100% of what you want to get so that you're not dumping out any additives or anything like that as well. Okay, so as long as it's a powder, it's, it's, I it's can put it, open it up. Absolutely, and it won't react with anything, so you don't have to worry about whatever you put it in, canceling it out or damaging it or anything like that. I'm thinking off the top of my head, whether it's circulation vein support or whether it's vitamin C or whether it's calcium or whether it's essential one or CoQ10, not a problem at all. CoQ10 is more fat soluble, so it won't disperse as well as you'd like, but it would disperse better in something like yogurt or things like that. 
Oh, okay, great. All right. Well, thank you. You're welcome. Thank you, Mary, right. so much. Thanks, Again, Mary. If you want to speak to Andrew live, you can on one 376 8255 We have about 45 minutes left. We're going to head over this way. This is the, the quickest. Fast. <laughs> like a yo-yo, yes. backwards and forwards. Um, don't forget as well, at the end of the show, everybody will have the final opportunity until October, I believe, to order Choco Nouveau. Is it until October? That's right. Well, after midnight tonight, all HS and pricing, all the pricing goes up. Right. And after April 30th, because it's it's just a monthly special. It was a today special last year. Yes. But we didn't, a lot of people were upset that they had one opportunity and then it went away for six months. So it's not back until October. So Choco Nuvo, we'll talk about that in a little while. Yeah. But Choco Nuvo, it's going to be, tonight will be the last airing of it, and then the monthly special price will continue until April 30th, and then it goes away for until the better part of October. That's how we're going to end our show okay. this evening. Well, yes. we, we promised you things that we've never done, that I've certainly never done before. Andrew, what on earth is Ultima Gamma Vitamin E? I haven't talked about this product on air for probably about, and we've continued to improve it, for probably about six or seven years. We'll also in a moment talk about our Gamma Tocotrienols. We could probably get the graphic up of Gamma Tocotrienols below. A lot of folks are told by their doctors to consume extra vitamin E, uh, whether it's their cardiologist or whether it's their internist, whoever it might be, they're told to consume extra vitamin E. The typical vitamin E product in stores is alpha tocopherol. It's synthetic alpha tocopherol. It's DL alpha tocopherol. Um, synthetic alpha tocopherol is something that no one should contemplate taking. In fact, alpha tocopherol itself, it's kind of like when we look at omega-3s. Mm. The most important omega-3 is the secondary omega-3 in most omega-3 products. The most important omega-3 is secondary. Um, whereas in our omega-3 product, we make the most important omega-3 primary, DHA. The same with vitamin E. The most important form of vitamin E isn't alpha tocopherol, it's gamma tocopherol. It's the most potent, the most protective, the most important. That's why our vitamin E, gamma tocopherol, there's of course some alpha tocopherol in there, just like in our omega-3. We have DHA and EPA, we just give you more of DHA because that's the way it should be, that's the most important. The same with vitamin E. So gamma tocopherol is the most important form. In fact, if it came to taking just separate alpha tocopherol on its own, I wouldn't do that. Because then what little gamma I would get from my diet would get crowded out. So I would rather not take vitamin E at all than simply take the alpha tocopherol that represents probably 99.9% .9 of the separate vitamin E. Even in our multivitamins, in our essential one, we focus on gamma tocopherol principally and alpha tocopherol secondarily. So that's the proper way to deliver vitamin E. This is not something I've talked about for a long time, but it's incredibly important. And then tocotrienols are another form of vitamin E. There's tocopherols and tocotrienols. Tocotrienols are even more powerful and more protective. Same thing, you wanna focus on gamma tocotrienol and not alpha tocotrienol. So again, it, it's just the way vitamin E has always been done has been driven by an industrial manufacturing process. The way our vitamin E is done is driven by the natural forms of vitamin E that deliver the greatest benefit to you, which means if you want a tocopherol product, it's gamma tocopherol. If you want a tocotrienol product, it's gamma tocotrienol. Mm. The tocopherol product is more affordable. Tocotrienols tend to be more expensive, but they are the only way to supplement vitamin E. The standard alpha tocopherol supplements are outdated, obsolete, and not as effective. And I've been saying that for decades. Unfortunately, the industry still sticks with the, the tried and true, which is alpha tocopherol, which is the industrial standard. And if you look at all the leading multivitamins, it's synthetic, which is surprising. Again, if you want to be more connected with Andrew, don't ever forget to check out wordsonwellness.com. That's Andrew's blog. It's his online forum, really, Andrew, where you connect with your customers. Yes. Well, you nearly walked into that and, board there. And I wish I had more time to post more, more blog posts there, do more videos, which, which I'm going to try to do in the future. Typically, I'll write something before the shows, but it's really something that I 
I view as the most important thing I do, which is not, we of course create wonderful products, but the most important thing I do is create the information. Right. Because the information means that even if you don't get my products, which I know most people watching these shows, they'll buy someone else's product, which is fine. Most people buy their vitamins in their supermarket or discount store, but they'll be more informed and they'll make a better purchase in that supermarket or discount store thanks to the information we provide here. Um, we're going to head on to Cranberry and talk about the wonderful benefits and effects and really talk about how this can help improve quality of life. And I think that's such a central theme to everything we've done over the past, uh, you know, hour and a half or whenever Andrew does these Monday night, show, uh, Monday night show takeovers, it's about quality of life, feeling better, feeling more uh, alive, having that zest for life. So wonderful things that many of us didn't even know existed. Um, our graphic says really everything you could possibly want on and, this. And what's great about this, this is a, a product, the preliminary question that seems to come up constantly, is there a better time of day? When should I take right. them? So what I always say is take them at the time where you'll be most likely to take them and enjoy the benefits because it's like these are not medicines but the key to getting the results from a medicine is what they call compliance that you actually use it appropriately on a daily basis the same with vitamins that you get the key nutrients you need on that daily basis but when it comes to cranberry I, I prefer to take cranberry at night for a very, very specific reason. Why? And, and we've gotten tremendous feedback from folks telling us that they've changed when they take their cranberry and the product works even better. And the product is already a product that's virtually perfectly reviewed. All we do is take cranberry, we concentrate the most beneficial compounds, and we put them in a capsule. So cranberry is one of those, uh, I say it's the poster child for a traditional ingredient that becomes respected by science, medicine, physicians. Because a lot of traditional ingredients are just kind of poo-pooed, they're, they're dismissed as right. not being valid, not being true. And cranberry is certainly an ingredient we know that absolutely does support the ur urinary tract health, bladder health. So it's something that has gone from traditionally respected to now being clinically and scientifically respected. And, and our cranberry, very simple, very straightforward, very affordable. And, and it's a product that delivers its benefits in, in a fashion that if you take it at night, well, think about things. When we go to sleep at night, it's always a good idea. You want to be hydrated. You don't want to dehydrate at night. A lot of people tend to avoid fluid at night because they don't want to have to wake up to right. relieve themselves right. over the course of, of the evening. But it's never a good idea to really dehydrate yourself because we're going to spend, whatever, six, eight hours or more in bed. But also, when it comes to cranberry, that's typically going to be the longest period of time where we're going to leave fluid in our bladder. Right. So what better time to make sure that our, our bladder is bathed with the protective compounds that are found in cranberry than during that period of time when those compounds are going to have the greatest period of time to deliver their protective benefits. So that's why we say taking cranberry at night, that's the best time. So obviously we take nighttime at night before we go to sleep. And, and cranberry, you could take it any time during the day and it's going to deliver its benefits. Some folks take a couple of capsules, they take one in the morning and one in the evening. But if you're taking only one capsule of cranberry daily, I, I would say the evening is the best time to do so. If you'd like to order cranberry, again, you've got all the different sizes. Remember, Andrew does the try me size as well on virtually everything. So give it a go it's, for 20, 30 days. It's a, it's a chance to, to experience the product. And this is one of those products, if your urinary tract bladder has been speaking to you periodically over the years, then this is an opportunity to naturally support it and, and to have a, a healthy dialogue with it. So um, many of us are different parts of our bodies as we get older, they, they tend to be having Having an even louder dialogue with us. So it's it's often a question of changing our diet, changing our lifestyle, intelligently supplementing, and and we could quiet down that dialogue. I think I'm having full-blown arguments with lots of us <laughs> on my body after you, sir. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna go to the phones because I know Linda is, I believe, in Ohio. Linda, welcome to the Monday night show. You with Adam. Linda, say hi to Andrew. Hi, Andrew. How are you? I'm great, Linda. How are you doing? I am so fine, thank you. Great. I am so thankful for all of your products. We oh, love you. I'm glad, thank Aww. you. That's sweet, thanks so much. So do you have a question? Uh, yes, I do, Great. regarding your circulation and vein support. When right. I hear you talk about it for you know people that are standing a long time and maybe have swelling but 
Right. Um, what about issue for some restless leg syndrome and sometimes mm. when you get sleepy, that kicking that you get in your legs and things like that. What, is it helpful for that? If, if you looked at some of the reviews, you'd probably see that mentioned, oh, I'd say probably a hundred times or more in the reviews. And I, and I always wondered about restless, restless leg syndrome being a sort of considered a, a disease or a disease state. I'm not sure if, if it technically is. Um, it certainly exists. Uh, but for me, to the extent that after I go for a long run or a long bike ride, my, my legs would sort of take on a life of their own uh, mm -hmm. afterwards, that since I've been using circulation vein support, and that's been for the last 20 years, that was a, that's a thing of the past, and I've never experienced it again. So I think like so many of the reviews, if, if it's something where you're, you know, as we get older, we spend too much time on our feet, our, our body doesn't adapt. When we're young, we get away with everything. Um, and as we start getting past the age of 30, our body just doesn't quite handle the things we throw at it with the same kind of grace. So circulation vein support is definitely something that can make a difference in, in how our, our legs feel at the end of the day, especially so many of us have jobs that, you know, we, we do our shows here for a few hours and we're standing up. Yeah. I, I couldn't imagine a job where, and it's one thing to be walking around a great deal, but say it being a cashier or something like that, or, or a nurse or something where you are in a relatively confined space and yeah. you're, you're standing on your feet for eight, 10, 12, or 14 hour shifts, that's, that's demanding and one would expect that our legs are gonna be talking to us at the end of the day. And that's exactly what circulation vein support's designed for, exactly. So, okay. uh, well, is it sounds it, like do, something maybe I will try and see if it helps. It has, it comes with a 30 day money back guarantee, just two capsules a day. 30 days is more than ample time to see a difference. Do you have a job where you spend a lot of time on your feet or? No, actually I don't. So I'm not really sure what it is. Maybe it's lack of exercise right now, but um, well, it's, it's something that I've been struggling with. As, as I said the other day, whether we stand too much or whether we sit too much. It, it, it both challenges the circulation in different ways, but both challenges our circulation. I said this about joints, whether we spend our lives being extremely active, that's challenging, demanding to our joints, or whether we're sedentary, that's also challenging to our joints. So again, it's, it's just the human condition, and as we age, you know, our, our body unfortunately reminds us that, um, that we're still here, mm -hmm. and it's still here. So I think, I think you'll enjoy the benefits, and as I said, it comes with a 30-day money-back guarantee, so you'll either enjoy the benefits or it will have cost you nothing. So I, I do think you'll find a great benefit using it. I appreciate that. The only other question is, you just mentioned a few minutes ago words on wellness. I was going to ask you if you have a special website where we can go ahead and throw out questions to you yeah, that I, would be, get at, answered online. Actually, at ProCapsLabs.com, which is our website, there's a little place called Ask Andrew. You could also just okay. call the company and ask a question for me in the call center, and, and they will make sure that the question gets to me. So oh, I appreciate uh, that. that. That's our job is to answer all your questions okay so, all right I appreciate it thank uh, you so much oh thank you're welcome you, Linda thanks Linda take care uh, and just to Linda's question on the back of every single bottle there is the number for pro caps which is of course Andrew so you can call and ask right and that's and we've always done that and that's that's really our job our, our job is to make sure I used to always say a long time ago that I want your you know if you're deciding to get a product I want it to be informed mm. but once you have the product I want you to remain informed and a lot of times questions come up and so we have folks who can answer most questions, but if they can't answer the question, it's going to come to me. And that's, that's in Nevada, that's our, you know, we have a lot of the- She's the exercising at we the have same the, time. We have the standing and walking desks. No, so he was doing a workout in the background. No, it, it's, it's, a, it's a very um, health conscious environment. There's Nancy. Forward thinking, I think, as well is the right term. Well, we just, I, I, because again, if we if we sit too much, it's it's not beneficial. So a walking desk or a standing desk, there's all sorts of research now that just if you if you simply look at how much time we spend sitting, just like blood pressure level, blood sugar right. level, cholesterol level, how much time we spend sitting is is on its own a risk of heart disease. So we would we want to spend we less time sitting if we possibly can. 
Well, our producer, Steve, God bless him, he's trying to keep us on track. He's yes. saying... Oh, we didn't even talk about cinnamon. He's saying 60 seconds on cinnamon and berberine, okay. Steve? Very, very quickly. So uh, one of the most common questions I was talking about different, you know, health risks that, that our, our society, the way we live, the way we eat, our changes in body composition, um, blood sugar level is something that we're challenged by. And we mm. do a lot of things working with our doctors or our diets to improve the numbers, to improve how we metabolize uh, blood sugar, how our insulin metabolism is handled. And cinnamon is an ingredient, the first ingredient that we had directly that there was science and research talking about its benefits in that regard. Mm. So cinnamon, the reviews are virtually perfect on cinnamon. We recently introduced berberine. We've actually had it for a few years, but we recently first spoke about it on television, I guess probably within the last year. And berberine is another product, both in terms of blood sugar metabolism, but also lipid metabolism, our cholesterol levels and things like that berberine, but uh, cinnamon is just one or two capsules daily. Berberine is one or two capsules with each meal. Right. Two capsules with each meal to get its maximum benefits, some great science and research on berberine as well. We're going to head over to phosphatidylcholine, I believe. Yes. And Andrew, we had a question. We, 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 obviously, we've had a lot of people ask about the children's vitamins right. and also um, uh, pet vitamins. There's a question asking about a, a line of senior vitamins. Um... <laughs> <laughs> there, when it comes to senior citizens, um, their requirements aren't unique from, say, anyone else. And, and it's sort of when I look at beauty products and you see a, a hair vitamin, a nail vitamin, and a skin vitamin. Yes. They're all part of the same system. It's only one product. As we get older, um, I, I might say that our requirements for supplementation or our opportunity to benefit from supplementation become even greater. Maybe sometimes it's because of the sins of the past or simply the simple passage of time that our systems are more challenged. But a, a senior citizen doesn't need a different set of vitamins, meaning our circulation vein support shouldn't be any different from someone who's 75 years old right. or from someone who's 25 years old. Our or say any are essential one. The same nutrient requirements for a senior citizen would apply vitamin D levels. You'll get the same blood levels of vitamin D approximately if you are someone who's 25 and the same body composition as someone who is gonna be 65 or 75. So again, I think it's a bit of a fallacy when you create senior vitamins. Perhaps maybe there are certain ingredients, certainly when you, when you look at the leading multivitamins, they love to do that. And usually the differences between the leading multivitamins mm. are silly. When you look at a, a woman's vitamin versus a male vitamin versus a senior vitamin, they're almost silly. Um, so as far as I'm concerned, I, I'm going through the list of our products in my head, whether we just spoke about cinnamon, we're talking about PC. Yeah. The requirements, these are dietary supplements. It doesn't change whether someone's 80 years old or whether someone's 25 years old. These are not drugs. This is not going to change based upon some disease we're trying to treat or cure because we're not doing that. So again, that's a bit of a fallacy that whatever age we are, we have our nutritional requirements and we have our own unique genetic requirements. And that's, uh, that's not differentiated by age, that's just differentiated by our so individual biochemistry. So, so hopefully that answered the question, but I think senior vitamins, it's a bit, of a, a bit of a fallacy. Well, since we've been talking about that, it seems that the pricing on the screen for this one has got everybody's attention. Guys, we'll spend yes. a couple of moments, liver and the brain, very important. Yeah, this is something we tend to focus on toward the very end of the year because this is an ingredient people tend to focus on when it comes time. You know, at the end of the year, we tend to eat with a little more abandon, drink with a little more <laughs> abandon. But throughout the year, most of us need to take medications. And, uh, and, and I think, you know, back to your question on whether senior requirements, mm. I think seniors take many more medications than younger people. So I, I think someone in their 30s, the average person might take two or three meds. Right. In our 50s, it might be three to five meds, and it just keeps going up. That doesn't apply to supplementation. Unless, of course, we're trying to support in a healthy way more systems in our body. But on a specific product, it doesn't need, we need, mean we need more of that. So if you're taking this at 35, one or two capsules a day is perfect. If you're taking this at 85, one or two capsules a day is again perfect. And, and if, that were, if that weren't the case with any product I made, of course, I would speak to that. Right. Circulation vein support two capsules, perfect, at 25, 35, 
85. You're going to get the benefits. You could read the reviews from people 25, 35, and 85. So PC is the principal phospholipid in our, in our liver. It's also the principal phospholipid in our brain. Mm. So when we look at phosphatidylcholine, we're looking at an ingredient for those of us who want to support our liver, which is the liver, I always say it's sort of the Rodney Dangerfield of organs. <laughs> I said vitamin K2 is sort of the vi Rodney Dangerfield of vitamins. Vitamin D used to be. It just, he was the comedian who used to always yep. say, I, I don't get respect. Right, right, right. I, I won't do my Rodney Dangerfield <laughs> no, imitation. Please. But a long time ago, I actually got to meet him. Did a long you? time ago. He's no longer with us, but uh, yep. This was in California? In California, yes. Oh. So, but when it comes to um, phosphatidylcholine, we, we really don't think about it much, but in the decades since I introduced it, the only thing that's happened is it's been, rec choline's been recognized as being uh, underrepresented in our diet, that mm. we don't get a su sufficient amounts of choline in our diet, that, that it's an essential nutrient. So it, it's something that whether we're young or whether we're old, phosphatidylcholine is something that's a critical ingredient, especially when we take medicines to support our liver and our liver's requirement to constantly maintain and repair itself in the face of all the kind of dirty work it needs to do on our behalf. We'll stay right there if you'd like to order it. Are we head? Oh, can we spend a moment on liver antioxidants as well? And then we're going to go over to Fibromucil. A lot of people still calling and asking about Choco Nouveau. It's right at the end of the show. We promise we'll get that. With liver antioxidant extracts, that's kind of the other part of the sort of liver protection equation or program. When you're talking about phosphatidylcholine, you're talking about the building block. When you're talking about liver antioxidant extracts, you're talking about botanical extracts that have been shown to help support and promote regeneration of the liver. And the liver is unique. I mean, if you cut a little piece off of your brain, your brain's not gonna regenerate itself. Um, your liver will. So the liver has a, a remarkable ability to regenerate itself, which kind of goes without saying, given the, the dependence we have on it and kind of the dirty work it needs right. to do. It, it cleans all of the, the nasty things that possibly find themselves in our body. That's the work of our liver to somehow process, metabolize, and get rid of on our behalf. So liver antioxidant extracts, it has three standardized extracts, the most important being milk thistle extract, standardized for silymarin. It also contains turmeric extract, our standardized turmeric, and also our, that's complexed with phosphatidylcholine, the product we just got done speaking about. And of course, and of course we also have artichoke extract, standardized for cinnarin. Those are the three botanicals that I have found with the best science in terms of supporting the detoxification and regenerative properties that the liver possesses. If you'd like to read some of those reviews, and obviously with our time constraints, we're not able to do a lot during the show tonight, certainly go online. You'll be able to see about both of these items and see what other people have had to say about them. Thank you for shopping with us, of course. As always, that special pricing is extended through tonight, but only until tonight. So bear that in mind. I'm going to grab my pen and my paper. Andrew, we had a question about... Um, storage and optimal storage conditions, uh, especially for those of us that are buying the bigger sizes that last right. over a year. Well, our products are designed to, to be sort of stored in the normal temperature we'd have in a home. It also recognize that some of us live, we're in Florida now, right. and in Florida typically the humidity throughout the year is probably somewhere between 60 and 100%. Right. I grew up in New York in the summer, it's 100%. Maybe it's 150%, <laughs> it just feels like it is. Um, so, but the products are designed to be stored at temperatures that are really, uh, if, if it's going to go down cooler, that's fine. Cooler works fine for vitamins if they were at, say, in the 50s or 60s in a cool cupboard. Um, but ideally, we, we assume it's going to be in the 70s in your home, and periodically it could even be in the 80s. But we, it's not ideal to be storing a product after it's opened at, right. at greater than 90 degrees. And even the humidity is not a problem at all, so long as you don't have a combination of high humidity and high right. temperature. That is the enemy of vitamin potency. If a product's going to be 90 plus degrees and 90 plus percent humidity because then heat and moisture can contribute to the degradation of the ingredients. Again, it won't be toxic. It just could lose potency under those conditions. 
well, over the course of the past couple hours, we've featured a lot of maybe you call it hero products, certainly the ones that you love, fiber muscle. But, but fiber, <sighs> fiber is one of those products that's kind of bulletproof yeah. anyhow, so fiber won't lose potency because fiber is something that you don't absorb. The way this product works is by not being absorbed. So this product works by having no nutritional value whatsoever but it has fiber value. And what's great about our fiber is it's such a fine powder that it's so mild, yeah. it's, and it just passes through you so gently, but it delivers the benefits of fiber, the cleansing benefits, the benefits in terms of regularity. This is a product that Mira and I joke that we don't leave home without it. Right. That if we're traveling and we forget it, we get it sent to us immediately because it's not one that we want to go a day without. Even though we both eat a fiber-rich diet, mm. the, the couple of capsules we take every day of this, and I, I tend to take one or two capsules of this with each meal. It just makes a, for me, a profound difference in how my body processes each meal. This is one where I really feel though, when you go head to head with other fiber products in the market, it's an interesting lesson to see there's, why this is different. No, there's, it, it's sort of one of those things that I always say, I'd say you could compare us to the competition, but there's really no comparison. Right, right, right. Um, because there's, there's no calories or sweeteners or anything added. The typical fiber products in the market, most of them now aren't even natural fibers. What they do is they've created these synthetic fibers. Some of them you can mix with water, stir it up, and it's clear. Mm. That's not natural fiber. And a lot of them are different processed maltodextrins. So they're wheat or corn so sourced fibers. Um, that, uh, and a lot of them are just going to be fibers that are not going to be gentle, that can cause gas. So we've created a product that despite how small the capsule is, that just with one or two capsules with each meal, even to start, you could do one or two capsules just with one meal right. and gradually work your way up, that don't underestimate the power of the fiber here, given how small the capsules are and given how mild it is. It won't cause bloating, it won't cause gas. It delivers the fibers, and again, this is a product that you would know if a fiber product was a problem, you'd read it in the reviews. Yeah, yeah. There'd be no escaping it no in the holding reviews. Back. Because especially whether it's like an omega-3 product mm -hmm. or a fiber product, we expect them to be nasty. And, and people would, on the internet, people are not shy <laughs> because our commentary is anonymous. We are not shy about sharing something like that. But you read the reviews on this product and I think it's 95% positive reviews. It, is. it really is. As we wrap this up, we invite you to take advantage again. If you've tried other fiber products and they didn't leave you with a smiling face, certainly try Andrews. Well, yes, why not? Andrew, we're, you know we have just, like 17 minutes left. I'm, I'm getting so many steps here, it's incredible. <laughs> I know I your Fitbit's about to explode. I, I, I didn't have many steps today, but I now have 12,000. <laughs> we're getting our exercise in backwards and forwards and backwards and forwards. Uh, next up, something that's certainly uh, a, a big part of the reason why I've taken to so many of Andrew's products when it comes to digestion. Digest Assure, I know I am not alone in loving this. It, and, and Digest Assure is the most straightforward approach to digestion. Yeah. And, and if we just want to look at digestion on a very simple level, I, I often say the, the, the most unpleasant thing, the, the most unhealthy thing we do every day to our body, and of course I'm saying this a little tongue in cheek, is eating. Yeah. Even if we eat the healthiest diet in the world, we're putting foreign material in our mouth. Mm and we're telling our body, okay, here's this foreign material, you need to break it down, and you can't use heat or anything like that, which heat is how you get a chemical reaction to work very well, so you can't use heat. You have to break this down into its constituent molecules, you have to extract those molecules you want, and then you have to get rid of everything else, which is fibromucil, helping the fiber helps it get out of us. You have to get rid of it before it's problematic, before it literally becomes toxic. And how do we break down these complex foods, whether we eat chicken or fish or beef, whether we're eating fruits or vegetables, whatever we throw in, or a dairy, cheese, yeah. whatever we throw in our body, processed foods, how do we break them down? 100% the work of enzymes. Our, our body also uses pH, by pH meaning adjusting the acidity or alkalinity, but it's 100% enzymes. And as we get older, if we're under stress or different issues, medications we're taking, our secretion of enzymes becomes unreliable. If we're taking drugs like uh, antacids, like proton pump inhibitors, we change the pH, the enzymes become less effective. So that's why Digest Assure for me 
since we introduced it more than a couple of decades ago, it is the foundational mm -hmm. digestive support product. That's why we call it Digest Assure, because enzymes are all about digestion, and this product is all about enzymes. It's 100% pure enzymes. Cannot recommend it enough. Definitely place an order for yours if you can. Um, let's pack our bags and go to California and say good evening to Barbara. Barbara, welcome to the Monday Night Show. You're live with Adam. Say hi to Andrew. Oh, Oop. she's redialing. Barbara. Bye, Barbara. Are you there? Hi, Adam. How are you? <laughs> good. How are you? I'm doing good. I'm watching you right now. Yeah. <laughs> We're not watching you, though. But I wanted to ask you a question. I never get to get the... I mean, I'm, I, I work, so I never get to hear you sometimes. Yeah. About, I know nothing to do with what you've been talking about, but I just ordered the hair, skin, and nails again. I'm having issues with my hair, like, breaking off, and, right. and uh, which I never have that issue. But anyway, it is now. Right. So I was going to order that marine collagen peptides, right. and I was reading a lot of reviews about it, and it said it also is good for people that have uh, bad knees and joints and I've got bone on bone on both of my knees and uh, so I've had gel put in them and, and uh, um, the cortisone injections right. and and I've got arthritis in both of my kneecaps well I work 50 hours a week and I'm with babies so I'm up and down up and down so wow. I was wondering would that be a good vitamin to take I mean that peptide for that too right it's... or is there another one that's better for that I would probably say if if you glucosamine and chondroitin is where I usually recommend starting with with our, our knees and things. And funnily enough, in talking about the marine collagen peptides, Muriel loves marine collagen mm. peptides for its benefits to the radiance of her skin and things like that. But for me, I've always the benefits of that product for me are all about you know I've done sports my whole life and I've definitely beat up my my joints, especially my knees. So that product for me is all about my joints all about my knees and ankles in particular, knees, ankles, and hips in particular. So, you know, you're, you're bone on bone, uh, and I, I suspect they've done hyaluronic acid injections and, and, and also cortisone injections, things like that, to, to try to make you more comfortable. Um, but so, so this is not going to be necessarily therapeutic, but to the extent that you know, the collagen peptides can support the and enhance the replacement of collagen tissue, that could be beneficial. You know, it's not a drug or a medicine, but even if you're bone on bone, I would imagine there's still some collagen tissue doing its job on your behalf in your bones, in your bones. So this could be just what you need in terms of enhancing the replacement of that collagen tissue. So again, it's not a drug or a medicine, so it's not going to cure or treat that problem, but collagen is something that's an integrated protein that's essential for the the structure and the function of our joints so so it absolutely could deliver benefits okay and there's no other one that you would recommend besides that one too I mean I could get that one too I mean for the skin well, part too the the first thing if you were if you were talking to a more holistic practitioner the first thing they might recommend it was going to be glucosamine and chondroitin because glucosamine and chondroitin, those are the structural molecules of our joint tissue. Their glycosaminoglycans are a critical component in synovial fluid, the fluid in our joints. So that might be what they would recommend first, the glucosamine and chondroitin, and the next step would be the marine collagen peptides. But, but either one comes with a 30-day unconditional money-back guarantee. You could do your own experiment. If it works, you'll be thrilled. If it doesn't, you simply get to send it back. Okay, well, that one, will probably the marine collagen will help the skin if it doesn't help oh, the knees. It, it does for <laughs> sure. That it will. That's, that's where the most abundant <laughs> so science. That's good, so I won't lose on that one. But Absolutely. Can you sell that other glucosamine, uh, uh, that kind of a vitamin, too? Glucosamine and chondroit, yeah, that's available. We spoke about that earlier in the hour. Mm -hmm. We'll get the graphic up on the glucosamine chondroitin on the bottom of the on the bottom of the screen. We have marine collagen there now. They'll get the graphic up there. And again, the marine collagen, that's the real science of marine collagen originally was with the beauty benefits and, and the joint benefits were sort of a secondary benefit that they noticed and it's certainly the benefit that I rely on. And whereas really, I think, really, really. Yeah. Okay, well, I, all the ones that I read, I mean, they were all talking about their their joints and their knees, and yep. one was having a knee replacement. And she decided to take this, and now she has no more knee pain. And I thought, oh my right. God, well, that I, would be great. Yeah, I think that would be great. I, I mean, I'm active. I'm really active, but I just don't want to have knee replacements. Yeah, I, I can't mean, it's, have to work. <laughs> it's 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 a nice option to have those procedures available. But I always say that to the extent we can do things naturally to support ourselves and work with our doctors, then then I. I think we should try everything we possibly can. 
Me so, too. So uh, uh, could I find out about that other glucosamine one? It, it, I, th I think we'll get it on the screen here. Or we'll get the item number for oh, you, Barbara, Barbara. If you hold on, we'll have our folks put you back through to our customer service. When you get through to them, Barbara, just tell them that you want Andrew's glucosamine products and they'll be able to locate it for you, okay? Oh, here it is. It's Barbara, it's coming. We got it here. It's coming. There it is. 080185 is the item number. Thank so, you, Barbara. I thanks, Barbara. Barbara. It's right there. Let's go this way. Okay. This is good. This is live. We're interactive. We're answering no, questions. Fun. They're good questions, I, though, as I well. love this. They're, no, no, they're great questions. We could just go on all night, Andrew. I'd be happy to do so. <laughs> Let's do it. This is... The hard work for me is leading up to the shows. This is, this is, the, this is the easiest and most fun part of my job. And I, I yeah. thank you for saying yeah. that. The same as me as well. No, I love doing this. Uh, I, I, and we love that you're enjoying it as well. We are moments away from our grand finale item, which is going to be the last oh. on air presentation of Choco Nouveau. But I, first. I still can't believe that it, it's almost two hours. I know. It's, it's the, the fastest two hours of my life when we do this. So, but Ultimate Friendly Flora. Please, yes. Um, and, and I was asked the question, um, I saw on the list of questions, that are we going to do a separate prebiotic? Um, the fact is that both of my probiotics contain prebiotic ingredients. And prebiotic are basically the food that our friendly flora love to eat, the probiotic loves to eat, sort of prebiotic. Mm. But also, we could do a good job in terms of feeding our friendly flora the things they love. And unfortunately, the hard part about that is if you want to be feeding your friendly flora the things they love, you're going to be eating things like cruciferous vegetables, legumes, green leafy vegetables, because the fructooligosaccharides that are present in those foods, that's the food. So our, our friendly flora, they're, they're healthy guys. They want to eat the healthy stuff. That's what they enjoy. So one of the additional benefits of eating those healthy foods is that we end up with a healthier complement of friendly flora in our gut, which right. supports our immune system, which supports healthier digestion. So again, when we do healthy things, we get far more benefits than we anticipate. The benefits tend to be much broader in scope than we'd ever hoped for. So with a product like this, um, you deliver the best quality, the best balance of 25 billion, that's with a B, 25 billion colony forming units. But if you want to get the maximum benefit from the product, even though it contains prebiotic in it, then you also eat healthy as well. Right. You also make sure that you're consuming the cruciferous vegetables, not the processed food, because to the extent you eat a healthy diet, you then help these, um, the friendly flora, what is it, be fruitful and multiply. Yep. We want our friendly flora to be fruitful and multiply because that's our best defense in terms of our immune system. It's also the best defense in terms of healthy digestion. So we are, we're literally outnumbered. A healthy person has more friendly flora organisms in their body than we have cells. Wow. And we have trillions of cells in our body. That's crazy. So that's how important they are to our lifetime experience over 3,000 reviews 3,000 reviews Barbara in California was just talking about reviews she'd gone on and read what other people had to say we encourage you to do the and same. it's uh, again this is a product with about 80% five-star reviews well over 90% positive reviews so it's a product that delivers and as I said 25 billion colony forming units billion is big <laughs> there's about what seven billion people on the planet right. or so so there's more colony forming units in each capsule <laughs> <laughs> then there are people on the planet by more than times three. So it's, it's a very high potency product. Well, with that in mind, let us come to our big finale item. The monthly special, we've waited till the very, very end to do it. And folks, our wonderful guys and girls in our call centers are prepared for what we expect to be a huge demand. Because as Andrew will share with us, Andrew's breathtaking breakthrough product, which is cholesterol lowering, tasty, delicious, creamy, luxurious chocolate, uh, is on air for the final time until October. Uh, the last chance to be able to order is the end of this month. This will not be seen again live with Andrew though. This is the chance to stock up and make sure you've got yours. For those of us that already have Choco Nouveau, that eat Choco Nouveau every day as their sweet treat, you already know it is a mega product. No, and it's it's not the, the best tasting healthy chocolate. It, it's just the best tasting dark chocolate, yes. period. Um, and unfortunately, at the end of this month, I haven't figured out how to overcome mother nature in this regard. We're usually great at working with mother nature when we make our products. In fact, 
This product exists because we figured out how to take one of Mother Nature's healthiest ingredients, add it to dark chocolate, so that it lowers your cholesterol, but that healthy ingredient also makes the dark chocolate have the texture of milk chocolate. It also makes it less bitter. So for those of you, if you're like me, I was always a milk chocolate mm. consumer, but this is, this is dark chocolate with the texture of milk chocolate without the bitterness of dark chocolate, all the richness of dark chocolate, but none of the bitterness. So on that way, in that way, we figured out well how to partner with Mother Nature. But in terms of the heat of summer, our chocolate is so creamy, and typically dark chocolate is dry and brittle, but our dark chocolate is so creamy and so rich that it melts in summer. So we can't ship it directly. So unfortunately, uh, we have to go away. We tried shipping it in summer, we were unsuccessful, we tried everything, but it's just so rich and creamy, uh, unlike any other dark chocolate, that it melts in summer. So from April 30th, at the end of this month, it goes away. So this is, this is the today's special pricing from last year. So it's the best value it's ever been, and you have that value, we get it, get it tonight. Tonight's the last airing of it, and then it goes away until October. We, we, as we expected, are seeing a huge demand right now, so please be patient with us. I just wanna give some guidance. If you are a person like I was that did not like dark chocolate at all, I want you to choose the 66%. So the 66%, there's 74%, and there's 91%, and that's the uh, strength of the cacao. If you like milk chocolate the best, go for 66 if you like dark chocolate, absolutely go for the 74. And if you are a hardcore dark chocolate lover, go for that 91. Each of these is incredibly smooth and delicious. We could spend the next five or six minutes talking about oh, the health benefits. I can spend the next two hours <laughs> speaking about the health benefits because what we don't even emphasize, even if you don't get my product, one of the best things you could do on a daily basis is consume dark chocolate. Right. Our dark chocolate is very low in sugar, but dark chocolate is rich in protective compounds. It is more, it's richer in protective compounds than red wine. It's richer in protective compounds than green tea. Um, dark chocolate is truly an amazing food. There's all sorts of science on dark chocolate and how populations that consume higher levels of dark chocolate have a long list of health benefits, including benefits to heart health which is appropriate because our dark chocolate is the heart healthiest dark chocolate in the world because if you have just one square of our dark chocolate with each meal, and even just say your two largest meals you had one square, you can expect your cholesterol level to drop 10 or 15 percent or more. Amazing. Your total and LDL, lower your, your low density lipoprotein cholesterol, your bad cholesterol, lowered by 10, 15 percent or more. And that's a delicious chocolate. And having that chocolate that lowers cholesterol didn't compromise the chocolate. It made it the best chocolate in the world, yes. the creamiest yes. chocolate in the world. So there's truly nothing like this chocolate. Plus each square is only 26 calories. I've been asked to do chocolate bars and probably that would be a great idea and a very good business. Mm -hmm. but. I'm sometimes, um, I'm better at health than I am at business, <laughs> so we will not do chocolate bars. Because the research and the science on chocolate, there's another body of research that is great for weight loss, but it has to be portion controlled. And even then they talk about portions of 50 to 75 calories. Ours is 26 calories. So even if you had one or two squares with each meal, this still supports you eating less at that meal and it still supports a weight loss regime. So we really wanna make this all about being a healthy product, all about delivering the benefits of dark chocolate and not delivering sugar and, not, and also lowering cholesterol. But just quickly, these are two charts that are sort of amazing and surprise people that if you look at 26 calorie squares of our Choco Nuvo, 66%, 74%, 91%, they're 1.8, 1.4, or 0.5 grams. Mm -hmm. So in other words, this is about a tenth of a teaspoon of sugar. Unbelievable. So if you look at healthy fruits, 26 calories only, you're looking at multiple times higher levels of sugar in healthy fruits. So even better, let's look at healthy vegetables. <laughs> So again, the, level, the low levels of sugar in our 26 calorie square of chocolate. Yep. You can look at cauliflower. Cauliflower has four times, actually about five times the sugar per 26 calories as our Choco Nouveau 91. Wow. So none of those vegetables actually have as low levels of sugar as our Choco Nouveau. So 
Again, there's nothing like it. And I, I simply say, don't even, don't even judge it as a healthy chocolate. Just judge it based on taste versus the most expensive chocolate you've ever find. And mind you, most of the really expensive chocolates are not organic and they're not fair trade. So ours is organic, ours is fair trade, yep. ours won't be bitter. Uh, the 74% is amazing. The 91% yeah. is for the hardcore uh, chocolate lovers. It's serious dark chocolate, but again, not bitter, and, and it's creamy. The 66% is for those of you who love milk chocolate, but you will not find another dark chocolate anywhere in the world with the texture of this product, the taste of this product, and the cholesterol-lowering benefits of this product, not a one. In, in the 18 years I've been on television from England to America, it is quite simply the biggest breakthrough innovation uh, product I think I've ever seen because we all typically agree that we love chocolate. And what Andrew's done is he's given us a healthier chocolate that still tastes, let me tell you, as delicious as the gourmet chocolate you would buy in the mall. And, and originally I was thinking of doing a capsule with standardized extracts of chocolate in it, but then I thought to myself, why deprive people of the benefits of chocolate, the delicious taste of chocolate, if you could do it without making a product that compromises health? Right. And even better, if you could do a product that unexpectedly lowers cholesterol and unexpectedly it could help to lower the risk of heart disease. And that's exactly what our Choco Nouveau does. And just to reiterate, this is uh, basically the last time it will be on air until October. So if you need to stock up, this is the time to be able to Not do basically. it. Basically, it will be the last <laughs> time it will be on air. And I wish, I mean, it's, I love this product. I, I love using it myself. I love talking about this product. And, and it's just unfortunate that it has to go away. I mean, if we were selling product in stores, of course, then you have refrigerated tr sure. trucks take it to the stores and you get to take it home. But we only offer our product direct. I've chosen not to offer my products in stores, much to the disappointment of those stores, but we only make them available here at HSN. So that's the only opportunity you have to get it. So we have to go away from, from April until October, we just have to go away. You, you really have to try it. And let me assure you, even if you're stocking up on the larger size, and of course that's on flex pay of about $35, even if you buy this size and you try a couple pieces and you don't love it, Andrew would want you to send it back. Oh, absolutely. And the, the return rate on this product is exceedingly low. The, the ratings are exceedingly high. It's, it's, I think, again, a product with about 80 plus percent five-star reviews. And that's for dark chocolate, and most Americans don't don't like dark chocolate. And we even had a review I read the other day that talked about compared to the dollar plus per square um, gourmet chocolate they get, this tastes better. And, and our normal price is closer to that gourmet square because of the cholesterol lowering ingredient we had. But today, with our today's special pricing for the rest of the month, it's a fraction of the normal price. So it's a great opportunity to try it. And if you don't love it, you send it back. But you're gonna fall in love with the chocolate that's the healthiest chocolate in the world. And it's a dark chocolate that even if you love milk chocolate, you'll still love our 66 or the 74. Uh, and please remember, if you are a, a mega lover of, of milk chocolate, go for the 66%. That's fabulous. If you love dark chocolate, go for that 74. And as Andrew said, if you're hardcore, go for the 91. Thank you for your orders and your calls. Andrew, final words on this one? Oh, no, it's just I, I love doing these shows, and I, I'm thrilled that you give us all the questions and the call-ins, and don't hesitate to get questions to my company. That's what we're here for, to answer your questions so you stay informed about your health. Andrew, we'll see you back in July for our birthday month. Yes, in a few months. Thank See you, everybody sir. soon. Thank you for all the questions. Thank you for all the calls. We're going to eat some more chocolate. Stay with us. Our today's special is happening right here, right now. Good night, everybody.